But without further ado, um, I bring to you a very special guest. It is my honor to, to have. <laughs> it's Janice Griffith, dude. It's this who that's who we have in the studio right now. The there studio. you go. Say hi. Also, this get get closer to the microphone. Please. I already you're. Why are you being such a noob? Like we already practiced this. I'm not and a professional podcaster like you, Hassan. I mean, you've been on camera professionally, okay? Yeah, but we don't use any of this shit. Okay. Yeah, you do. You use microphones and stuff. Don't you lie. You mukbang. I you don't do mukbangs know what on Pornhub. Okay. Um, that's a spit guard. First and foremost, if you if you must know, that is a spit guard, okay? That's a spit guard. I don't like that you made me lower the 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 uh do you want to turn it back the up? light yeah because okay, like now we're up. both in the dark like you're okay, turn it back let up. me see i'm gonna i'm gonna adjust also, it one more i don't time. think it's angled properly I'm it's like, fine no you look great here. are you checking okay. it from your phone yes oh jesus christ dude okay. okay whatever um yeah all the horny boys in the chat are probably very excited i am uh, and i'm of course familiar. i'm of course friend to ragbang who fucking Says creepy shit all the time. Ragbang, you better cool your jets, okay, buddy? I don't actually think I'm award-winning, by the way. I've I never jerked off I've to her. Been. Yeah, people tell me that out of respect to me that they don't jerk off to you. I'm like, that's wrong. That's the you opposite guys should. of what you should no, do. No, yeah. I, you I should think jerk that, off to me out of respect for Hassan. Yeah, out of respect for me. If you guys want to uh, jerk off to Janice, go ahead. <laughs> We've jerked off to Hassan, though, they say. Well, that also makes sense. Um, horny boys and horny girls. Anyway. So yeah, this is Janice Griffith, guys, and um, I just wanted to wanted to see because uh, a lot of there's a lot of uh, misinformation out there about sex work and whatnot, and um, you know because like every time I I like wear something that is like uh, Pornhub related, there will always be like at least a couple white uh, white feminists sounding off, uh, you know, red flags in the uh, in my mentions going, oh, that's disgusting. You're a misogynist. You're terrible." Porn should never be consumed. We should just, you know, throw all of the sex workers in jail. I think that would be better for everyone because I hate sex myself personally. That's usually what they say in mentions. Obviously, there's people who I've debated before that get oddly specific when we're having semantics arguments. But um, you know what I'm talking about. Anyway, what's up, Janice? Talk to us. I'm doing a very hard. I'm having a hard time not revealing your Christian name here. Just my kidding. Christian name. Wow. <laughs> Your government name. I was going to say, are you going to be able to call me Janice over and over? Yeah, I know. I've. This is, I think, literally the first time I've ever had to call you Janice know, and right? um, and through an extended period of time. So, yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, I think it's really unfortunate that people take this overarching idea that sex is bad, sex work is bad, everyone is oppressed and... You know, you're doing it out of necessity. So instead of making the world a better place so you don't have to do this job out of necessity, I want to throw you in jail. Yeah, it's weird. Um, you talked about you've been on TYT before um, talking about Sesta and Fosta. And I don't know if you want to give us information on like what the latest has been, like how the sex work community has been impacted by um um by sesta right it's i mean or yeah. fosta i mean it, it's they're the, the same, same thing but yeah one is stop enabling sex trafficking and the other is i don't know they're they're both the same uh weird acronym for like we hate whores um i think it goes into effect next january if i'm not mistaken but so far i've seen at least 20 people are missing. A lot of people are confirmed dead. Um, a lot Jesus of Christ. escorts who previously had the safety of working online and, you know, using bad date lists and screening lists are, um, you know, forced to work on the street or doing something less safe and without those resources to weed out potential predators and abusers. Um, it's really horrible. It's just another attack on sexuality and people in general. Um, I have nothing new to say about it except sex work is real work. Oh, but also pumpkin pie addict asks, do you view uh whore as a negative word? Well, it's sort of like reclaiming slurs, you know, like I'm a whore, so I get to call myself a whore. But if someone else called me a whore, it would be a little weird. 
Especially if they're not a whore themselves, is what you're saying. Exactly. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, cool. Uh, do, do you guys have any other questions, or can I call <laughs> Hassan a whore? Uh, he yeah, is a whore. I do. I call myself a whore all the time, so I guess it's uh, appropriate and acceptable to do that. Um, okay, I didn't want to get into, like, super fucking serious shit right off the bat, but, um, yeah. If, but if I we... banned you on Twitter, it's because you said something stupid. Wait, what? Who is... Janice, why you ban me on Twitter? Oh, did you retweet it? Are your fans coming in now to the stream or I something? I retweeted it, yeah. Oh, there we go. Okay. Yeah, um, I know. I, I can answer that one. I can answer the why'd you ban me on Twitter question for you. Um, if Janice Griffith banned you on Twitter, it's because you probably deserved it. And you can probably get... Uh, there, are gr there are grace periods sometimes where she will unban you or unblock you on Twitter for whatever amount of money that she charges... Uh, for the pleasure, but but that doesn't mean you won't be banned again. If if you don't fucking behave, then you'll get banned once again. Just so you know, Hassan is that correct? Rules. Are, are these are these correct? Yeah. Okay. You got good. It. I'm glad that I got it. <laughs> Puritanical nut jobs. I don't know what else to talk about really. Like I, I I thought that people would be like, oh, like I thought people would have like a thousand questions for you. So I don't well, know. There's there's one like. From your experience with other porn actors and actresses, would you say most workers enjoy their job? I've heard claims that most do not. There's this weird idea that in the sex industry, everyone has to enjoy their job. You know, nobody is really upset that, nobody asks if accountants enjoy, enjoy their job. Nobody asks if lawyers or doctors or teachers enjoy what they do. Like sex work is work and I can't speak for the majority of porn performers because now, you know, in this year of 2018, porn isn't the same way it was in 1997. Porn is being made by your next door neighbors who make amateur videos, just the two of them. Porn is being made by the guy down the street who hires girls off of Craigslist to do a blowjob clip store. You know, it's not just mainstream performers in big studios on 10 websites. It's huge it's overarching it's it's a big big industry now so you can't exactly there are no blanket statements for pornography it's like saying do people do movie actors like their job i'm sure some of them do and i'm sure some of them don't but it's it's not a monolith it's what's the um i think um connor habib has a decent distinction on this that i find interesting i don't he know says if it's porn is not a monolith it's a medium or, oh, no, that's not what I was referring to. I was going to say uh, his, his perspective on consent is uh, really interesting where he talks about, like, enthusiastic consent is different than, like, when you're working, enthusiastic consent is different than, like, even though you consent, you can still unenthusiastically still yeah. do your job and still consent to doing your job. Um, and that's, like, a, um, that's a distinction that he draws. for, And I'm butchering it a little bit. Well, and I know that this is, like, a... This is a, a, a very sensitive subject, so I don't know if I'm going to, like, well, totally wreck that. But um, what you're getting at. Like, you can not want to do something, but still consent to doing it. You know what I mean? Like, I can go to work, and they can say, hey, this is the scene today. Are you okay with it? And even if I'm not okay with it, I can still say, yes, I'm okay with this, and do it. Just because I'm not okay with it doesn't mean I didn't actively consent or give my consent. Yeah. Um, so, I'm not even going to address Ragbang's question because it's say, ridiculous. Don't even. I was going to say, if it's a woman, gay for no. pay? It, well, he just said get, got, gets fucked in the ass. Like, he didn't say with what or by who. That's true. So... I guess it's if someone of the opposite sex fucks you in the ass, you're still heterosexual. You're welcome. Um, if you, yeah, I guess. Uh, okay. How annoying is it in public to deal with guys thinking they can get sex easy? Mia Khalifa. Uh oh, there's a Mia Khalifa reference in here. Oh, I don't fuck with Mia Khalifa. She wore a hijab in a porno, even though she's Greek Orthodox Arabic. Like, she's, she's not even a real Muslim. She's not Muslim. I'm more Muslim than Mia Khalifa. I mean, yeah, obviously, you are Muslim. So, that's not you. You're like literally Muslim. Oh, 
People I, are asking about your background, by okay, the way. Okay, no. He, so I commented, I tweeted that I was making curry chicken, and he was like, chicken curry with an asterisk. So I blocked him. Don't correct me. That's why you got blocked. Look, it's not, it's very, it's very <laughs> easy to get. She is ban happy, but I get it. Like, I've seen some of the, I've also, seen some of the stuff that like, you don't um, deserve it for free. I've like, seen some of the stuff that I, uh, like my friends that do uh, lighter versions of sex work get, uh, or even like, you know, yeah, it's some somewhere on the different uh, scale on, on like the uh, hierarchy, right? Isn't that the right word? Yeah. Sorry. I'm, um, I'm scrolling through the stream on my phone. Yeah. Too. So like, it's, it's fucking, it's brutal, dude. Guys are really fucking awful. Let's be real. I mean, guys are really awful on the internet. We're super horny. I get it. Cause I'm super horny all the time as well. So like, but you know, the older you get, the more you're supposed to be able to fucking wrangle those, uh, those hormonal, uh, also, those hormonal tendencies where you're off. like, oh, don't yell at me, jerk off. There's no reason to yell at me. There's, <laughs> there's just no reason. Um, to, I don't know how to say, Kawasumi, um, I'm a trans girl wanting to get into sex work when I'm later in transition. What's the best way to start? I don't really have a lot of resources for trans girls, unfortunately, but Groovy Girls is like the biggest trans porn site out there right now. I've heard great things about them. I know a couple of people who shoot for them and have shot for them. And I think if you just like messaged them, they'd be down. Someone said, how do you feel about, uh, I don't know if you want to answer that, but what Dan Bilzerian. I mean, I don't know if I'm legally allowed to talk about him, but he's a tool. Okay. That's, that's good enough. Um, I shit. don't want sex work to be regulated and taxed. That sounds bad and really unhealthy for the workers. Oh, yeah. So let's, um, let's get into that for a second. So there's a distinction that a lot of people, including myself, who are even like, um, interested in understanding uh, or, or very open-minded about sex work in general uh, that oftentimes throw out the statement that we should legalize prostitution. And what I've, well, yeah, so that's what I was getting to, Janice, if you wouldn't, if you would let me at least host my sorry, goddamn show sorry, for a I'm brief moment. We're over familiar. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're just gonna, you're just gonna cut in here and be like, uh, hold on a second. But my point was going to be so that I could look informed, even though you're the one who fucking told me this shit originally, is that um, there's a distinction that a lot of sex workers draw between decriminalization and legalization. My understanding is that most sex workers are advocates for decriminalization, not necessarily um, legalization. So can you talk about that? Yeah, I just want to acknowledge that sex is halal. Many Muslims just don't want to acknowledge it. Yeah, did someone say that? Yes. I mean, dang, I'm glad that you're reading the fucking comments better than I am. <laughs> um, yeah, so decriminalization over legalization because of regulation issues. Right now in the United States, there are cops who will rape sex workers, who will coerce sex workers into sex acts by um, threatening them with arrests or charges if they don't participate. Um, violence. Who was it? Was it a... a a border patrol guy had killed like 10 women um i i believe he killed five before he got caught but yeah um and most of them were sex i mean all of them were sex workers i think and then most of them were trans sex workers so right now sex work is not legal in the united states in terms of prostitution and escorting um regulation is bad think about wow Sounds like a true Shut capitalist, up. you guys. Shut up. I guess we have hey. a big we have a big hey. capitalist hey. girl in here. Hey. I was wrong. Okay, so think about the people that are creating the regulations for legalized prostitution in the United States. Are these people that we trust with the safety and well being of the workers? Are these people who have our safety and well being in their best in, in our in their best interests? Is it reasonable? to think that they'll protect us if something were to go wrong. There are so many people who can't even call the police when they get assaulted because they were doing some kind of sex work. There are strippers who are raped who don't feel comfortable reporting it because law enforcement will think that they were asking for it. So that's why regulation in this context is bad unless they were willing to create the laws with sex workers in mind and with sex worker input. 
Okay, that's a reasonable uh, assumption. What's your What's your political perspective uh, across the board, Janice? That's a question that what? no one really asked, but what I want to. What is wanna, that supposed to mean? I don't know. What is What's your What is an ideology that you uh, you you find yourself? What are you doing? Oh my God! Um, oh my God! You you can't see from over there, but I have. Oh, show I have. Oh show no! Uh, she just jumped down. She got she got scared and jumped off me. But your your That's pitbull the love opal. That you do not opal. Do not try to get on the bed. I swear to God. No, it's the the thing made the, pss, and she yeah. was like, "What the fuck is that?" Yeah. She um, was giving you the love that you were begging for earlier. I know, I know, and then now she's not. Just and... call her over. Opal, come here, come here. Not fish, not you. Come here. Okay. Fish. Anyway, wait. We were talking about this, so go on, go on with your perspective, please. Um. Let's build guilties. Um. I was asking what your ideology was. Yeah, I ju I just said it. What was it? Say Let's it again. build guillotine. Let's build. Okay, you want a guillotine? Guillotine. You, guillotine. You uncultured. Guillotine. Oh my um, god. Um. Anyway. Okay. So there's that. Do Wait. Someone asked. Yeah. Do male porn stars before the sex? Uh. Yeah. Most male porn stars use Viagra or Cialis. Um. Some of them use this like weird injection where they like inject their dicks, but that's that's very unhealthy. Would not recommend. Wait, um, what do they uh, asking for a friend? What do they use? What is that? <laughs> what is that substance? I I don't know. It's like a prescription that you inject into your into the base of your penis. What does it do? Is it like make it larger? What's the no, deal? It's, what are we working No, it's just like with? Viagra, but an injection. It's for oh, people. Oh, it just like makes you harder. It's like Supreme ED. What? A, <laughs> please do not talk about injecting anything on dicks. Jesus Christ, that hurts. I mean, I don't know. No, it's not just... sounding like into the base of it. Crazy still... that you guys know what sounding is, though. Um, What's sounding? Uh, urethra insertions, like when people stick things into your dick hole. Ah, ah, okay, okay. Let's. Holy shit, that is. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, let's not do that. What um, the fuck, dude? But if you All want right. your dick to be harder, take maca. Ask your doctor, obviously. But it's um, nice. Yeah. I, 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 there was him. a point in time uh, uh, where Janice had recommended maca for me as well. I used to use it, but I stopped. I don't know. And is my it because you're an incel? Fun. What? Well, part of it is because I'm incel and I, and I don't have sexual cell. intercourse. But uh, the other reason why is – no, I'm not a volatile. I'm like a straight-up incel. Like literally no one wants to have sex with me. This is canon. It's fine. Maka. It's M-A-C-A. And then um, now that – Hassan, now that Loomer exposed your Antifa comic book to Jank, what are you going to do? I guess I have to pack up my things and leave and only work for Twitch now. Like only have a Twitch channel because um, Jank will certainly – yeah, Jank will certainly fire me now that he knows that I have an Antifa comic book uh, <laughs> behind me that depicts the history of fascism and anti-fascism all around the world. So, but beyond that, let's get back to the let's get back to like sex and sex work related questions that you may or may not have. Um, yeah, maca is a uh, is a thing that people use. There's like different variations, like red maca, black maca. I don't know what the fuck they do. Like what the differences are. I know you have red maca. I and I was blend. using black maca. Oh, you were using a blend. I use a blend. But yeah, give them. Um, how was. Bobby Form. How was Bobby Form? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Are uncircumcised male porn stars less desired slash discriminated against? Literally nobody cares about your circumcision status in the year of 2018. I. I get the question all the time. Really? That, yeah, I get it all the time. And I'm like, dude, none of us give a shit. And also, sometimes you can't notice. Like, when a dick is super hard, you can't always tell if there's a foreskin. Like, if it's really hard and the foreskin is pulled back. There you go. That's science, dude. You're, you're a dick scientist. So if you, if you say it, it's canon. It, not only is it canon, it's, the, it's empirical truth, basically. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Bail that said lie. I don't know. Uncu uncut, undeterred, unashamed. <laughs> Holy shit. No, people get really fucking riled up on the internet about circumcision stuff. Like well, I watched I watched American I Circumcision know. on your dime uh, recently. Hassan and still uses my so I got him or I gave him my old Amazon TV thing. So everything he watches on Amazon gets billed to me. So every like couple weeks he just Venmo's me and is like, here's for the things I watched. 
And I was looking on Amazon, and it's like, wh what is the thing called? American circumcision. American circumcision. I was like, what the fuck? Because also, I smoke a lot of weed, so I'm like, did I watch this like while I was too high? No. And no, I didn't. No, I did. But you should watch it. It's very interesting, and I, I recommend you guys all watch it. It's just kind of weird because it's just like a lot of people who are really caught up, like yes, really obsessive over big. baby dicks. Oh yeah, talk about uh, dicks that are too big. I guess. Yes, there are dicks that are too big. I mean, for me personally. Yeah, I she is literally my sugar daddy, by the way. Not to cut you off, but yeah. Yeah, I'm his sugar daddy. Um, I have done femdom stuff. Some dicks are too big. Vaginas are only like four to six inches anyway. Um, I thought your vagina was longer than four to six inches because you have like... My pussy is magic, but that's unrelated. Yeah. I, I don't know. That's what they say. I cannot confirm nor deny Plug my flashlight again. Yeah, wink. Um. Wink. Is there such thing as what? too small? Yes. Is there such thing as too small? Um. Yeah, there is still some um. Sigma for crossover male performers. My friend Charlotte is engaged to Lance Hart, another friend of mine, who is a bisexual male performer, and there are companies that have blacklisted Charlotte because of her fiance because he does crossover work and there are a lot of people who you know you aren't allowed to work with trans performers if you're with certain agents it's bad and stupid i can't wait for all of the old people to die out of our industry honestly well you heard it here first folks janice griffith asking for old people to die of old age <laughs> Um, not even doing anything to stop them from dying. Um, okay, so yes, wait, let's I'm go back ex. to the dick size because I know that this is he something that... He doesn't want to smoke weed. What? Who doesn't? He, he, he used to smoke weed, so he says. Are you talking... Are you answering questions about me now? Yes. Is that what's going on? I feel this is an invasion of my personal privacy. I did not consent to giving a personal information Well, out. someone said, Janice, will you please get us on stone? Yeah, no. Um, okay, so this is a question that... This is a question that uh, everyone asks, right? Uh, yeah. Which is, um, you know, the dick size stuff. Cause, and you're, like I said, you're a dick scientist. So let's get back to it because okay, I ready. will most likely clip this and put it on YouTube as well. This is something that, like, everyone always – because like, I feel like, I, I, speaking from my own personal experience, there are, like, a, a, a million questions that I've always wanted to, to ask porn stars, given the fact that they – by the nature of their work, um, uh, have seen, uh, you know, a lot of penises, uh, like at least someone in, at the highest levels of porn, such as yourself, Janice. Um, anyway, uh, yeah, that's why I wanted to like go a little bit into detail about dick preferences, dick sizes, small dicks, big dicks. What are the, cause like a lot of porn stars say, well, like size doesn't matter. Obviously there's a term called, what is it? Size queen. Oh, yeah, size queens. Which is, like, what? Just people that... People who love, like, the biggest dicks. Like, just the biggest dicks that you can find. Um, I feel like, honestly, the younger I was, the bigger... Oh, my God, fish, I love you so much. Oh, I love you. All right, keep going. I'm don't so get... Don't get such a... Opa, Opa, off. Off the bed. All right, keep no, going. No, she was on me. Um, so... A lot of people, or no, when I was younger, I feel like I could take bigger dicks and be like, woo, like it, it was fine. And now I'm like, uh, like I'm too old for that shit. I can't just, I can't just fit that craziness up there anymore. Um, my personal penis preference is big, but not gigantic. It's like, like just a little bit bigger than average. Perfect. Um, I don't personally like small dicks. Sorry. Uh, and recently I got the question, do you think that there are more small dicks or more wide vaginas? And the answer is 100% more small dicks. Do you think that every girl that you've ever had sex with has a wide vagina? What are the odds? What are the odds? Maybe the problem is you. Someone said, do you value girth or length? Do I value girth or length? I think it needs to be an appropriate ratio, you know? Like, 
It can't be too long but skinny, but it can't be too fat and not long enough. It needs to be, like, proportionate. Everyone loves a fat dick, though. Um, I can't. I also can't see Hassan, which is why I look so funny. No, if he's it's behind fine. a monitor. I'm like, I'm like, this is uh, partially. I'm terrified. Partially, I'm terrified because, like, I feel like you're gonna reveal some information about what I'm packing, and that's why, Do you guys like, want I know to that talk everyone is Hassan's like, dick? I know that everyone is like secretly asking questions, mostly because they want to learn like what the genuine preference of like people are, or what girls are, or girls' preferences are. But also, yeah, see, look at how many people fucking freaked out as soon as I said that <laughs> Hassan be packing exposed expose him. him. I'm just, I'm all, all, all I'm going to say is there is plenty of information readily available on Janice's Twitter account where she. Uh, describes my penis uh, while we were uh, while this we were is, seeing one another. This is so. That's and that's all that you should say. He beyond is that. exposing me right now. I'm. Oh, I'm exposing you. What do you mean? Oh, oh, because like there was never a, a, a face associated with your tweets, with your subtweets. Yeah. Oh, okay. True. That's fine. What about your subtweets, bitch? I'm not. I've never subtweeted you. I don't know what you're talking about. Should I pull up receipts? Destiny's dick is on the internet already. Time to size up. What the fuck? Jesus Christ. They the dated? F- what the fuck? Yeah, except he never said that we dated until we broke up. Okay, whatever. Like, um. Yell at him for toxic masculinity. Wow, now everyone's saying I have a snub nose revolver because you said I like dicks that are average but just a little bit above average. Can you I please- didn't. I said I like big dicks that are just slightly above average but not that makes gigantic. It seem like, that makes it seem like I'm just slightly. Never mind. Okay, oh whatever. Oh, my God. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm sorry, everyone. Hassan has a huge dick. Thank you. Thank you for, thank you for covering for me. That was very nice of you to just fucking – Wow. Wow. That's just... Hassan is really skinny, and he has a huge dick, and he has no problems, um, no addictions at all. He he doesn't need to chew nicotine gum all the time. Or caffeine nonstop. Yeah. He doesn't drink coffee at all, ever. Yeah. I do. I do have to, I do have to drink a lot of coffee and, and, uh, and consume a lot of nicotine. Whatever. We're not talking about me. No one's perfect, okay? I feel like a bad person whenever I watch porn on Twitter, but I'm broke and can't pay the ladies appropriately. Just watch it on Pornhub on someone's uh, verified channel. Like, if you watch something that I've uploaded on my verified channel, I still get paid for it, kind of like YouTube. So you can still consume porn in a semi-ethical way, even if you're not paying for it. Just support creators directly. Don't watch that Twitter porn shit. Someone said, do your parents still talk to you? Why do you care? What if my parents were dead or like beat me all my life? I was just gonna say the they question? do. I mean, like, or I don't know. You 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 reveal this information. I don't know if it's like too much. Whatever. What? Because uh, isn't that a stigma that like people have? Where like, oh yeah, your parents like, um, uh, you know, it's like an yeah, anti-sex yeah. work stigma. That's why I was like trying to so um, open up that conversation. For a me, bit like, more. my dad doesn't care what I do. He loves me unconditionally. Like, I think parents love should be and I never really got along with my mom to begin with so we haven't spoken in a couple of years but it has little to nothing to do with pornography it's more just that uh I finally was able to cut off a toxic relationship in my life which I'm really proud of myself for actually and it does Muslim Twitter come after you yeah all the time like all the time um, it's because she's haram as hell, but not because she does porn, but because she eats pork. I don't eat pork. <laughs> I really, I don't, not anymore. But not, also, yeah, and also it's not even, oh, someone asked opinion on Stormy Daniels. This is a, interesting. Okay, so yeah. I think Stormy Daniels is whatever. I don't like that she's become the face of the entire industry. Um, you know, I don't know her personally. I don't know too much about her. I'm glad that she's using her platform to do what she can. I think Michael, what's his name? Avenatti. Yeah, he sucks. I think he sucks. I think he sucks super hard. Um, but I'm, I'm glad for the things that Stormy does. 
I think it's a little much the way that mainstream press has, you know, gone after her and made her out to be this. I don't even know what words to use for the attention that she's been getting. And, you know, I follow her on Twitter and people attack her every single day just for existing. So while I don't know too much about Stormy and I probably don't agree with everything she says, I really appreciate what she's doing for sex work in the public eye. Yeah. I mean, she got a... She, I feel like she got an entire generation of, like, baby boomer swerf moms to kind of, like, reconsider their perspective on sex work or at least, like, come out and, and even uh, say, like, well, technically, she's no. attacking Trump, so that's a good thing. Even minute. though they're still, like... Even though, obviously, minute. beyond that, they're still... Every time there's any sort of criticism towards her, it's always like, oh, Michael Avenatti's the porn lawyer, or oh, she's just a, a, a you know, they use you know, worse terms than, se obviously, they don't use sex work. Harambe. They're like, she's a whore, or like, she's, uh, she's a porn star, like, who gives a fuck about her opinion, or whatever. But then on the other end, at least, like, on the liberal side, a lot of people who would normally have, like, very swerfy takes have... Have been like, like oh, pushed into no. a corner to be like pushed into a corner to be like we. She's good, I guess. Yeah, yeah. we we like sex work now. That's weird. I, uh, but... Oh, I hate to agree with you, but your ideas are good, and I appreciate what you're doing. Yeah, a but similar, I hate. <laughs> a similar thing happened when um you know Colin Kaepernick with Black Lives Matter, right? Colin Kaepernick was kneeling for approximately a year and wasn't getting a lot of media attention beyond like what we were covering at the Young Turks and other like fringe or leftist media operations. Um, usually, even like the fucking Pot Save America boys, those liberal saviors, those neoliberal saviors of all America, right? Um, they were kind of against, uh, they were kind of against Colin Kaepernick. They would say stuff like, I get what he's trying to say, but I really don't appreciate the way he's saying it. And um, as soon as Donald Trump was against Colin Kaepernick, all of a sudden that entire movement exploded because a lot of people uh, only are capable of viewing politics from the framework of like how much they fucking can't stand Donald Trump. Uh-oh, you took the camera. What are you doing? You're taking control of the stream and I'm uncomfortable with the things that you're doing. It's just fish. I know, but like, how are you gonna put it back now? Watch, ready? Uh, okay. Oh, hold on, let's hold, see. Hold on, hold on. Let's see how good you are at, at, at let's this. See, let's see. Okay, but there's a delay. There's a delay, Janice. You're gonna let me. I'll do it. No. Oh my fucking god, dude! Holy shit. <laughs> okay. But yeah, my I point was. It. My point was, um, a lot of people are, um, I like unironically, a lot of people are, uh, pro sex work because of the because they only are capable of uh, viewing anything that is political for how much they hate Donald Trump. <laughs> And Stormy Daniels is like uh, inadvertently created an environment where so many people are, are hey. uh, seemingly pro sex work because um, they're anti Trump and Stormy's in opposition to Donald Trump. Yeah, I mean, she's been a really polarizing face and uh, figure for sex work. And I think, you know, I'm really grateful for her for that because I think it's fucking sweet that, you know, people are caring more <laughs> um but i haven't known stormy as a perform oh my god i'm annoyed because it's like not all right there we go it's not framed appropriately oh just my god keep going. i'm just so keep going. sorry just keep going yeah you ruined everything no i'm just kidding it looks great now you look great i'm sorry i'm what were you saying keep going oh, i'm sorry i'm reading the chat hassan no one wants to have sex with me hey guys here's my ex-girlfriend yeah we don't have sex anymore, so there you go. Um, anyway. The Janice people can... demand more fish. She's giving us fish time. Sorry, I'm trying to... Is every women porn star bisexual, or is it really fine with all girls... What? Is it really fine with all girls licking themselves, except what I'm confused by the framing of that question? Um, Kawasumi said, have you met me and Khalifa? I haven't met her, I don't think. I don't fucking Wasn't care she to saying her. she's not a fucking sex worker or something? Because oh. she's only shot like a couple porn. She did. She only made like ten pornos. Okay, so she's like now she's saying like she's like a barstool sports bitch. Oh damn, damn! Shots fired at me and Khalifa. 
Um, Stop saying her name. Okay, Ugh. whatever. Um, what's Janice's ethnicity? Would you like to reveal this information? You do it. I mean, what I, am I? Okay, so Janice, and I've said this before. Janice is Guyanese, uh, half Guyanese, half uh, white, but like all kinds of white. Come here. Um, it's Come like on. difficult to even uh, break down. I don't know what kind of white she is, really. But she's half guy. And he, okay, so, oh, come on, dude. You're not even taking this seriously. Oh, I my am God. too. Can yeah. you guys see this? I can't, so I'm she's, uh, I mean, technically, I guess you're Indian, right? Guyanese I'm, I'm Indian. I'm Indo Guyanese. Yeah, you're Indo Guyanese. Okay, I don't want to, like, you know. I'm sorry, say the my wrong dog thing. is too beautiful to ignore. Yeah, Ragbang is like a fucking. Uh, he, Ragbang is. Uh, uh, Ragbang is brown, and he's like a fucking brown supremacist. So he gets, like, weird. Uh, every time someone mentions like uh, any ethnicity that's not like uh, you know from the way he thinks is uh, how the world works Which so is don't what? take he's just like oh no she's Indian it's like no she's fucking Guyanese dude I've like yeah I'm, I'm Indo Guyanese like my, my people were taken there because of slavery but yeah, I'm still we, Guyanese like Indian Indian people don't like to claim us they think that we're like ratchet um yeah, you're, I mean, diaspora, right? You're a diaspora girl, technically, um, even beyond, uh, like, living in America as a Guyanese it, person. Like, oh. um, so, yeah, everyone is Indo-Guyanese in Guyana. No, yeah. not everyone. There's there's African people, so there's... Um, Except the black Guyanese. Afro-Guyanese. So. There are some people left over from the British and Dutch occupation, so there's, like, a sprinkling of white people. There's the indigenous people of Guyana, which they just call Amerindians, but I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Um, and there's like 1% Chinese people there as well. Yeah. Guyana is also where Jonestown happened. In case yeah. you've never heard of the place. Yeah. Um, oh, Guyana is right next to the Republican of, De Republican of Despacito, Republic of Despacito, which is Venezuela. Um, I don't know. You don't Eat watch my rats. Yeah, you don't watch my videos anymore. So, like, you probably don't know this. Like, was, you're probably unfamiliar. Okay, but okay. I say like Venezuela is the Republic of Despacito. I can't like sit around and watch your streams all day. Oh wow, no, that's cool. That's really cool that you're I saying have a this job. to 310 people who are watching the stream right now. I have Very a nice. job. Oh no, cool. No, these people don't have jobs. You're okay, right. Okay, but you're yelling at me for not having seen. I watch streams. your videos. No, you don't. That's yes, I do. Lie. That's yes, a I lie. have. I That's saw. That's a lie. I saw the one you shot at your uh, at your apartment. Oh, which one? Um, with the, the other girl watching or whatever. I saw oh. that. Oh, you watched it? Yeah, maybe I, I watched it. I don't believe you. Maybe it's I watched not like, it. What, what do you like? Uh, check pickup porn. What? Okay. Wow, you're fucking straight up exposing me on. What? Don't porn consumption shame me right now. Okay. Wow, <laughs> dude. Oh my god, I just embarrassed him. Look I just so blush. terrible. Look, he's blushing. <laughs> oh, oh my Can god. Can you see my beautiful dog? You can't tell because she's black, but like she's right here. Okay. I, I <laughs> You can't just drop a nuclear take like that and then move move on and be like, "Look at my dog." <laughs> That's fucking bullshit, dude. This was a terrible mistake. Oh, I'm so sorry. Um, anyway, yeah. Wait, okay. I'm not going to expose you, but it's fucking weird that you're still watching my porn. No, it's not. Shut the fuck up. You love that shit. You're, why are you trying to lie on stream right now? I know exactly what your perspective is on this, given the fact that you've <laughs> talked about this a million times. I'm going to expose you now. How about that? Can no. I just bring up my own tweets? No, yeah, no, she fucking Bring her on she, every night. Yeah, she loves she loves it when when dudes watch her porn, okay? She loves it. Even if there are dudes that were that, that she has dated in the past, dudes that she's hooked up with in the past. She fucking loves that shit, okay? So don't act like it's not it's the opposite. Anyway. Hassan, tell the stream, kisses, thank honestly. You for, what? Do you still use my flashlight? No, I I mean uh yes, yes I do. I've always used it and I use it all the time. And I love Don't lie lights. to us. I want the truth. Okay, but you know my perspective. Uh, I don't want to give my truth because it's, like, not conducive to you making money. My um, text messages would say otherwise. What? I used it one time you asked me, and I used it, and it was great. Thank you. It's, just, it's great, wanted. but it's just, like, not my cup of tea is it's what I was going to say. It's not your hand? 
is not yeah i love using my hand anyway i've watched 43 seconds of one of your films before realizing i respect women what the fuck you can respect women and watch porn that's the whole point rag bang god damn it um but yeah no shouts out to to the janice griffith fetch light it's it's uh let him compare to the real thing i've said it before it's really good it's great the real thing of course is like the best so i can't even uh compare but it's it's still very great it's great uh the Janice Griffith flashlight. If you're gonna go out and buy a flashlight, let it be the Janice Griffith flashlight. Okay. Woo! I'm trying to read this stuff, but it's like it's moving really fast. Yeah. Hassan is not a cuck. <laughs> Hassan is not a cuck. Well, no. Someone said Hassan's a cuck. Hassan, do you have? A... No. Well, cuckolding is like a specific kink, right? Um, and this yeah. is another thing that I uh, I learned from you actually. Because I, I yell at you about using the word cuckold, right? Yeah. So um, cuckolding is like a kink where you uh, like to get. It's like a kind of humiliating, right? Like you're supposed to be humiliated by the fact that like your your, your girlfriend other. or your significant other is like getting fucked by like a like a bull or like a larger man or whatever. Yeah. That's um, like the whole the whole. Usually, the idea is like from my experience or my understanding is like small penis humiliation tied in as well. It's like uh -huh. about um, emasculating um, and sh shaming them and also sort of, um, see, I have a problem with like sissy submission. Like I don't like femdom centric work where they dress a male sub up in typically feminine clothing as a humiliation because I don't think that feminine clothing is humiliating. You know what I mean? Which is why I don't agree with uh, like sissy fetishes. But for cuckolding, a lot of it is rooted in that sort of traditional masculine versus feminine. And it's really about the woman's pleasure and how typically the husband can't pleasure her so she has to go find someone else or like he invites his friend over and cuckolding is only gross to everyone else like the people involved in the cuckold are into it yeah like the cuck likes being a cuck he's not offended by you calling him that it actually reinforces it and helps him get off it's like if I said, yeah, I love getting hit in the face, so you punched me in the face to try and teach me a lesson, I would just like it. It wouldn't deter me from doing anything. So cucks actually, they like being called cucks. A lot of men on Twitter will actually, people who have humiliation fetishes will attack sex workers and porn performers and cam girls for the sole purpose of being publicly humiliated by them. Like, that's why I, I sort of stopped replying to people and just started blocking without a response because people, I was giving people free jerk off material. Yeah. Yeah. You, you fucking, you pay for that. Okay. You want, you want Janice to humiliate you. You got to pay for the privilege. Um, okay. So. Well, one of my faves and Hassan too. Yeah, no, I know. There's uh, I mean, people, people keep asking about you on the stream since I like plugged your fucking fleshlight so is like it? Is it over here? no no it's where the all the fucking fleshlights you brought back are in the, the bathroom. bathroom yeah i think i don't know maybe i moved it when i um when i showed it on camera but yeah um janice why don't you post on snapchat anymore because i have a private snapchat go buy it yeah janice is a private snapchat apparently janice please please expose the song's kink what's my kink i'm like you and i are both incredibly tame for I you like a couple things. I won't I won't expose you. Don't expose me. What it, it's nothing like crazy. No, but it's funny and it's specific. Look at Opal, please. I'm not I know, she's like I want to go outside. Well, Wait, she, I don't want to expose your kinks, but you're you are tame as hell in bed. I'm so vanilla. I'm just yeah. I'm so vanilla. You heard it here first, okay? Uh, Janice Griffith is the most tame person in bed. IRL when when she stop you're making when, it seem like I'm bad in bed no oh no of course not absolutely not that I will uh, be brutally honest that's not the case at all but um but super tame regardless incredibly vanilla 
What about the use of sissy porn in the trans community? It's a pretty controversial topic, but a lot of us use it as a gateway to coming to terms with gender identity. So I can't really speak to that because it's it's not my ballpark. I don't understand that, you know, mindset or being in transition or grappling with your gender identity. I just mean from a perspective of like using femininity to humiliate someone like like lace underwear ha ha fucking sissy i don't feel comfortable with that so i don't do it you know to each their own i think that there's a healthy way to do almost every kind of kink like i know someone who specializes in rape fetish porn and while it's not something that i would ever do he is like the nicest person i've ever met and he's the first person i ever let tie me up he taught me a lot about rope stuff and everyone that I know that has ever worked with him has said nothing but wonderful things and it's interesting because he does like setups where people are getting drugged or like knifed and you know bound and fucked and it's I like like Hassan said I'm vanilla as fuck so I mean you've done everything you like try you definitely <laughs> try every anime porn I bet I have watched anime porn. I've been open about this. This is not something I'm embarrassed by. Whatever. She's so cute. Get back together. What the fuck? Um, but uh, uh what do you Felt call like it? Hassan wanted to be exposed. We were. Okay, you're. First of all, you're reading like comments uh, with a delay. Okay. So just I'm, just oh pipe down God. over there for a second. Um. Oh, you've spoken out about this, and it's something I find super gross. But why is the entire porn industry dominated by family porn these days? Uh, you love this. You've talked about this, too. Um, it's, it's just because people started watching it, and now people won't stop watching it. And also because a lot of people don't care about the actual scenario. They're just like, oh, cool, people are fucking. They'll click on stepbrother, stepsister porn and not care that it's stepbrother, stepsister. I think people are looking for it, though. I mean, My perspective on this porn. was... Um, my perspective on this was that uh, I think that it's like because of the growing divorce rate in America or like the, the divorce rate in America has like played a, families. played a part that like, you know, you're surrounded by people that you're not literally related to. You don't have blood relatives. So you're you eventually, I guess, get like cabin fever or whatever. I don't know. I don't have I like have a, a stepdad. And, I would. I OK, have, I have a stepfather I, I, and nothing about that. Like, there's nothing about, like, fucking family that would ever turn me on. But, you know, if that's your thing, just do it in a nice, safe, consensual way. And, you know, I don't care. If is, incest is, is it because it's taboo? Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't understand it either. I, I'm, like, I'm pretty vanilla with my consumption as well beyond that, even though you just, like, exposed me for fucking watching uh, check pick up porn you God just damn it. said it and get you're exposing yourself it's over they put a quote the moderators literally it, when you go when you write exclamation mark porn on the fucking stream it shows th that i like check pick up porn thank you thank you for that so that was your fault i'm so sorry you can expose me for something I don't um, know what to I cry me. a lot i cry all oh the time oh my god yes i cry holy all fuck the dude time. oh my god yeah that is true yes i cry all the time. I don't Everything know. Do you still cry, cry all the time? No, not really. I've been going to therapy. I still cry, but it's not like I'm not like overwhelmed with emotions and crying. It's like, oh my god, I just love. I I think I like like crying. I think I'm just someone who like cries a lot, but in a good way now. It's less bad. Hasanabi, she cry because that dick too good. Yes, Ender. Yes, that is exactly. Actually, why. literally, yes. My real take is that it's taboo, but it's almost always because. You, if you're a recluse, your sister is the only female in age that you may have had a relationship with. I feel like a degenerate when I watch porn. It feels unhealthy. Why is that? What about it is making you feel bad? It's totally normal to consume sex stuff and want to jerk off. Don't feel so bad about it. Don't beat yourself up. As long as you're not hurting anyone, it's cool. I'm like thinking of what's the funniest way, what's the funniest reason you've ever cried? Like, but I oh, can't yeah. come up with one. Like, but there's Think like, one. what? Come on. I'm just like thinking about it now. Like, what's the, I cry every time I watch porn. <laughs> what's the, uh, what's the funniest way? What's the funniest reason you've ever cried is, is. One time Ari, I was in the car with Ari and like, we were coming back from getting breakfast and he was like, oh dude, did you see this like shooting? 
And he told me, like, he was just, like, casually mentioning news to me, and I just started bawling. I mean, that's not, like, a funny reason. I'm talking, like, it actually because, like, Steven Universe funny, ended or some shit. You know what I mean? Like, you... Okay, you, but it's coming back! I know. Oh, by the way, for those of you, uh, the, the reason why I watched Steven Universe is because of her. She uh, put me on it. It's very good. I also good. bought him that shirt. Oh, yeah, she did buy me the Steven Universe shirt, the Mr. Universe one. I don't know if you guys have seen that on here before, but, yeah. Um, I cry every time his song goes live. I cry every time. Nice. Um, anyway. Sex could be a special and sacred thing. Because, like, I, I think that sex is special and sacred and magical and intense. And that doesn't stop me from wanting to record it sometimes. I wish that Hassan would let me record our, se- our previous sex. But he would never. No. He would never. No way, dude. No way. And it's mostly like I, I and I've had this like I've we've had this conversation. We actually had a fight over it. We did have um, a fight. And 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 the reason why, wow, Hassan, you watched Stephen Universe at twenty seven. What a beta. And the reason why uh, I say no to it is because like I am so fucking self conscious about my naked body, given the fact that I was a Even I was a fat he's child. Even though really hot. Uh, and he, like I was a I very. I think he's really hot. I was a fat child growing up, so like. I would never, ever, ever in a fucking million year be able, million years be able to put my fucking naked body out there on the internet. Uh, then that is just like would never. I would cry for the rest of time if that happened. Because like Porn some, is because someone would be like, because someone would under the comments would be like, and that's why like I admire your bravery for being able to do this. You're braver than the troops. That's a certainty. Hell but yeah. uh, like if if one fucking person was like, oh man. That dude sucks. Like, his pipe game is weak. I'd be like, that's it. I'm literally killing myself. Well, like, you'd be a... lying. Regardless, I mean, it Wait, doesn't... someone said, porn is inherently toxic to natural human sexual real shins. You can't deny it's a vice. There are also people who fucking eat toilet paper. So... <laughs> I mean, like, I, I, we've talked about this on the stream before, so uh, my, you guys kind of know what my... Um, you guys know what my perspective is on this? Like I, I think that porn is is in, could be or has the capacity to be incredibly healthy, especially if you're like if you live in a very sexually repressed culture. Um, uh, for example, a sexually repressed culture like uh, Turkish culture, where um, you know it's it's there's still this like stigma associated with like losing your virginity before being married and stuff like that. Even though like people obviously don't, um, you know, even though people obviously don't like go by those rules. Uh, they they usually don't hook up with anyone when they're in high school. There was like one person that had sex in our entire fucking class when I was in high school in Turkey, and and everyone knew, you know what I mean. And there was like the stigma associated with it. So porn was a porn was an incredible outlet for me to let out my sexual frustration as I was going through this like incredible hormonal phase. Sex also, I mean, uh, porn Wait, also has the capacity to. Were you hornier than you are now? Not hornier. I mean, I guess maybe. I don't know, dude. I yeah, I that's, was. That's my question. Sorry. Yeah, no, I was. I was probably even hornier than I am now. Um, Interesting. But, um. So, I understand that sort of idea because you know my mom is Muslim, and growing up it was like, you can't date until you're married. Like that's that's how Muslim parents are, to to their female daughters. <laughs> Um, it's like, my, I remember my mom, I wasn't allowed to have sleepovers. I wasn't allowed to go to friends' houses. I wasn't allowed to have friends over. I couldn't walk down the street to get pizza. Like, I couldn't do anything when I was at my mom's house. And being told over and over and over that I couldn't do these things made me crazy. And I was a very sexual person to begin with. And I think I remember my mom at some point being like, listen just masturbate do not have sex with men and to be fair she's not wrong (laughs) you heard it here first folks janice griffith just masturbate do not have sex um have you thought about how initiatives like no fap is actually making people get a worse perspective on sex and healthy sexual view in general yeah fuck no nut november yeah that's not all the time yeah it's really strange to me I guess it's not so strange, but it is rather remarkable that there is this absolute pattern. If you look at any sort of alt-right movement or if you look at like uh, if you look at men's right movements and stuff like that, um, you'll notice what Janice, you ever thought of relearning your faith? 
May Allah guide you. <laughs> yeah, you should. You're you're too haram. Inshallah. Anyway, um, but what I was saying is like, if you look at these sort of things, like the Proud Boys, for example, uh, have a really negative uh, perspective on porn. They have a really negative perspective on jerking off. The the Golden God, uh, who is like that fucking Swedish Nazi dude who looks like he has like some weird skull issue. Uh, he um, he. Uh, preaches uh, self-help on the internet, uh, among other things like uh, how to be a Nazi, uh, and he he is uh, anti-masturbation uh, as well. It's really it's really shocking to me. I don't know why. Like so many of these like alt-right, far-right movements also vilify masturbation when it is certainly uh, for both men and women, for everyone, a, a, a really healthy thing, and especially for women. Like not to not to speak on behalf of women here, even though there's a Just like an actual fix literal your woman hysteria. in the. Foot. Yeah, well, that's what I was going to say. Yeah, it helps you fix your hysteria, oh. you hysterical women. No, I was going to say, like, um, in my experience, like, there are a lot of girls that even in America, even somewhere as, like, sexually, supposedly sexually liberated as America in comparison to Turkey, um, there were, there, there have been plenty of girls that I have, uh, I have been intimate with that, on bucks. that, um, shut up, <laughs> that, uh, don't know their own bodies because, like, because of the stigma associated with even, like, masturbating. And that is really remarkable to me, at least. Right, Janice, well. when you first started, were you afraid of making porn? How did you get started? So, I wasn't afraid, I don't think. I mean, I, I got into porn with the idea, like, oh, I'm just going to do, like, one scene. I'm going to go pay for my trip to L.A. And I'm just going to, like, try it out. And I did one scene, and... They were like, hey, do you want to, like, do this? It's clear, like, you like sex. You actually like sex. You're a good performer. And uh, here's more money than you've ever seen in your life. Because, you know, I did not grow up rich. And I was in Los Angeles, and I was like, fuck. I could just do this. I could just do this as You a made job. your passion your life's work. Yeah, ex literally. You're, I'm not even being facetious. It is my passion. It is my life's work. I love fucking. I can attest to that. I love fucking. That's facts. <laughs> this is true. Um, my friend has never had an orgasm before. I would suggest that anyone with a vagina gets a little vibrator and just uses it during sex. I tell I tell girls to use the womanizer now. Like I've no, it's not yeah. crazy. I mean, it's a little difficult to. I mean, it's like, hard to like have like yeah, do penetration little, stuff. We, with we've it. tried. It's not easy. Yeah. you but can't have sex with the with the womanizer also crazy. while it's working. It's not. I mean, you can't have penetrative sex, Hassan. Let's not get. Okay. Let's not be exclusionary. Okay. Not well, yeah, all sex you're right, is about right. penis and vagina penetration. You're right. You're right. You're right. Oh my god. You're right. But I'm not, everyone I'm here not knows it. No, no, no. I know you're. Right. That's why I said you're right. Um. Um. Yeah, I I would think everyone should get a little baby vibrator. If you check out Unbound Babes, they're a really cool company. Um, super sex positive. Uh, all of their products are body safe. A lot of sex toys are not. Um. I don't know what it is about sex toys, but they're not regulated as insertables or uh, health products. So they're sold as novelty items, so they're not all body safe. A lot of sex toy companies are just these disgusting, like if you open a toy and it smells like rubber or chemicals and it kind of makes your nose wrinkle, don't use it, don't put it inside yourself. Or if you are going to use a condom with it. Don't. What about tea tree oil, which you fucking love and it makes my nose wrinkle? I love tea tree oil. I use tea tree oil suppositories. Oh They're good God. for yeast infections. Okay, maybe you don't like the taste a little bit, but would you rather a yeast infection? No, no, for sure. Would you rather a fishy BV vagina? Okay, okay. Oof, oof, oof. Let's not even get in. That's what I'm saying. That. No, tea for tree sure. is good. Um, it's just like it's not. It doesn't smell great. I, I, I think it's too powerful. The aroma. It's like, you know. Um, the bullet isn't bad, says someone. Do you honestly think no, no, November has no merit? Okay. Albert Jebra. Okay, but why is a vibrator the same as a Volt Fuckmaster blow up doll? People use this. Uh, when I was on Jesus and Mero, me and Jesus talked about this. Wow, name drop. Let's, uh, let's just like, cancel okay. the rest of the show. Okay. Thank you. Has, Thank you for that. Hassan is just mad because he loves them and he wasn't on the show before 
no that's, that's awesome. fine they fucking yeah no it's cool dude um sure cool hey d's is a marrow i'm Can fucking i'm on to you guys all right sorry so, go on i um mentioned something and Jesus was like so vibrators are cool for women but I've, if i bring my torso through tsa everyone's gonna look at me funny and i was like yeah because those aren't equal sex toys this is massive like, <laughs> yeah what that's mean? what i'm saying so many people try to draw this false equivalence of like you know a vibrator is the same as a giant like fuck doll and that's just not the case Sorry, I'm looking at my dog because I don't know what she wants. I think she's sad because she doesn't have a soft place to lay down. And Meat Move said, oh my god, Jan, is tea tree not good for you? That's on par with vagina steaming, hella pseudoscience, grad student studying toxicology. I don't know. Sorry, she's, dude. It works for my vagina. She's a she. Um, anyway. Well, I was just I, gender neutral, dude. Like, sorry. It, it works for my vagina. It's like what I use all the time um i used to get yeast infections and bv when i first started shooting porn because it was just like all sorts of foreign shit going in my body and i use boric acid and tea tree oil to maintain my ph it can be a little harsh for some people but i just want everyone to like try stuff and only use what works for them because you know for some people coconut oil is great for their vagina and other people are like oh coconut oil ruins me and fucks up my pH. Oh, by the way, that was a copy pasta, just so you know. Hmm? Like the the thing, the fuck master one. That's um so on the internet there's this thing called copy pasta where they just like copy paste shit. I don't know. Um, I'm I'm like not on the internet enough. You, what do you you're extremely online, dude. You're just fucking lying now. Why are this is an honest stream where you're supposed to bear all and be fucking as truthful as possible with the people and instead Wait, I don't know. She just wants her attention, obviously, because because she's a little baby who like her can't. Mommy. Yeah. Like her Li Yeah, literally. I mean, Fish is a little baby too. Yeah, Fish is not as much as a little baby as as Opal though. Um. That can be. Used I have over three hundred thousand confirmed penetrations. <laughs> uh, yeah, nice. no, there's there's a lot of. Um, Janice is such a stoner. Are you high right now? No. Yeah, I'm shocked. I think I smoked like this morning, but I haven't. Yes, she has a sweater that says pork bun that looks like Pornhub, and I have the same sweater as well. She got me the sweater. Um. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not high like even a little bit, which is rare, but also true. Fake Muslims. Um, we're halal as fuck. Thank you. We're actually like this close to being your local imams. What do you mean? Are you talking about me and you, or are you talking about yourself? Both of us. Yeah, I guess. Hold on, I'm just like gonna do a quick promo as well here. Um. Uh, where was I? Okay, I'm totally baked. Yeah, no, people love Yalla, fucking. Habibi. People love fucking smoking weed on this on this stream. Everyone like talks about it all the time. I never, um, I never participate oh in God. those sinful actions. So what? I've given Asan a hard time about spreading them cheeks before. Have you strapped one on and shown Asan what it's like to be anally and not? Oh, Jesus Christ. That's the one. No. <laughs> no, I, I don't. I, I, he wouldn't I, even I've talked let about me it like, his ass. What? Oh my. God. Now you're fucking exposing me. <laughs> he wouldn't let me. Um. Oh, they're they're just. Uh, they're Now they're copying paste. Janice is my new fave Muslim. Fuck you, Hassan. Yeah, well, thank you. Janice, have you ever clapped Hassan's cheeks is the question that everyone is saying. Hassan got a booty. This is true. I do have a booty. I've never had it clapped. Janice, do you like gay porn, says Super Blue? Um, no, I don't like gay porn, but it's because I'm a narcissist, so I like to, like, see myself and stuff. I don't even <laughs> think I really watch other people's <laughs> porn. I almost exclusively only watch my own porn. And even past that, I would rather just have sex damn Hassan, that's counter revolutionary it's not revolutionary praxis to not get your booty eaten out and don't and get kink your shame cheek, him get not get your cheeks clapped i guess i apologize Hassan is such a fucking coward ask her about the stigma on fleshlights considering the copy pasta please yeah uh we we did she talked about it and that she said that it's not the same but like fleshlights don't I mean, they, they don't have a turns down an ass eating unfollow. Wow, you're literally, you're like, I'm you're fucking, so sorry. yeah, you're hurting me in my pocketbook right now. You know what I'm saying? Like, guys. Yeah, I'm over I'm here kidding. selling I ate your. I ass all day. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm out here 
selling your pocket pussy. That and delicious you're... cold brew cow's milk asshole. Oh, stop. Oh, my God. Now you're, ugh, ew, ew, stop, Did you stop. like that tweet? Oh, yeah, the, the Fair Life milk tweet? Dude, that... why do I get ads for it? I don't know. We have separate profiles. I know. I mean, I guess they just, like, assume that it's an ex-boyfriend on your account and that you should go out and buy Fair Life milk. I don't know. Have you considered getting your ass eaten might be good for your career? Did it taste like chicken? Co- okay, guys, that's gnarly. All right, everyone fucking cool it like a little are bit. Are you allowed like, to stay sober for work? Or, oh, or do you have to stay sober or are you allowed to smoke? Is deep throat feels good. I love dicks in my throat. Can confirm. Fair if life is ain't... god tier milk. Cow's milk is raw. <coughs> this is the hill I will die on. <coughs> I'm not, I, I butt munch. I just have not gotten my. Yeah, the, Hassan eats ass. He just doesn't get his ass ate. Thank you. There you go. There you have it, folks. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm glad that you guys you got that out. You said you go to therapy. Do you process feelings of guilt or shame when in therapy or for having done porn? Or is that too forward of a question? No, sorry. Oh, sorry. I didn't, I don't know. I don't, I don't have feelings of guilt or shame for doing porn. And that's why I have a lot of trouble answering questions about it because I, I don't have that. Like, I never did something sexual and um, regretted it in that way. Like, I had my nude sent around when I was in high school, and it didn't make me feel bad. I was just angry with the person for betraying my trust. And you're not supposed to send naked pictures when you're under 18 because it's distribution of child pornography. But... I've never been, you can't shame me for it. I just don't have a, I don't have a shame bone in my whole body. <laughs> also um, can confirm that as well. <laughs> um, Hold on. Janice, guy dick or girl dick? I don't think I've ever had a girl dick, unfortunately. I feel like Hassan would have shag carpeting back there. What do I? Your ass. Oh, no, I, I actually, um, I, I manscape, okay? Everybody calm down, all right? I mean, I'm not going to get into this because it's gross, not like you specifically, but like men should be shaving their assholes. It, otherwise, I don't know what you're doing when you poop. That just seems terrible and scary. I, I agree. I agree with that statement. I had an ex-boyfriend who his best friend is super hairy. I'm sorry if anyone that you know is watching this. But he was, like, so hairy. Like, he would take off his shirt, and it looked like he had a shirt on of his hair. You know what I mean? And when he would poop, like, he would go to the bathroom, and it would take him, like, forever because he had to wipe forever because his asshole was so hairy. Bidet gets the job done? Absolutely. I'm buying a bidet. I love bidets. Oh, of course you would buy a bidet. All right. It's, like, $70. Now, let's, let's, let's fucking – let's expose Janice a little bit, okay? Mm-hmm. I also to, uh, put this on Instagram if you want to repost it. But – um, let's expose Janice for a second, okay? So, she's, like, a total fucking crystal girl. That's first and foremost. Like, she loves that, like, tree, tea tree oil. She loves that crystal shit. She, Hassan, she like... You have a, an astrology poster for yeah, fucking girl. Yeah, okay. Don't expose me like that. I said that I was gonna give it to a girl, and then I no longer... And then you kept it because girls come over, and they're like, Oh my god, you like astrology? <laughs> What's your sign? Oh god. Oh, I'm gonna. Oh, this is so terrible. Um, okay, finish exposing me. No, I was just like, you love. Yeah, it totally backfired on me. Um, it's uh, no, you love. Um, why is my face so red? Because that's you're the, blushing. That's just like I've just only been red this entire time. Because you're blushing. Um, does he yell out Tommy Lauren during? Se- no. No. Not at all. Even though you had a... Do you want to talk about the Tommy Lauren porn thing? Oh, my God. I was going to do a Tommy Lauren uh, porn parody, but the girl dyed her hair black. Yeah, that's the whole thing. Yeah. The girl looks just like her, though. <laughs> Don't worry, Hassan. No one in here had a very high opinion of you to begin with. All right, good. Stop. Good. Uh, nice. Hassan is the best. Nice. Um, but yeah, I did talk about the astrology thing a little bit, so it's actually not that embarrassing. Um, okay. Okay, expose me. What, what have you got? No, what Lay was... Lay it on me. No, I don't know what I was going to... Well, I was going to say, like, you have... You do have, like, uh, aside from, like, crying all the time, you have, like, uh, these tendencies where you, you definitely... 
Uh, well, first of all, you always o- you always leave every every fucking cupboard open. Like uh, you cannot close. Like if you okay, it's I'm short. if you go to her house, no, that's not why. Yeah, because well, they, how did you open them? Head. But how did you open I them to begin with? Up. That's what I'm saying. She but never no. fucking closes her cupboards. I don't. Um, she's I very messy. Uh, Says you. Oh my god, my room is perfectly. Uh, right now, kept. my room is perfect. What's underneath this sheet? Okay, stop. That's What's not, underneath the sheet? Just like some some stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever. Um. Anyway. Yeah, you're. Do you you, she when never I dusted that lamp. You did dust my lamp. Yeah. Because there was a, a, an inch thick layer of dust on it. Okay. Whatever. Um. R.I.P. The sheet back. Janice, expose them. Rip the sheet. Rip, not R.I.P. It ripped the sheet. Oh yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what. I, I can't even read English anymore. English is my second language. I'm sorry. Um. Being that messy is the normal one. Roast game almost as weak as your pipe game. Shaking my head. Okay. Can He's you, better at fucking than he is at roasting. Uh, can you can you come to my defense for my pipe okay, game okay, at least? Okay. God damn, dude. What the fuck? Okay. Jesus Christ. Hassan is the best sex I've had in my life. Honest. Honest truth. That's my left wait, hand. Honest truth. Wait, why? Wait, hold on. First of all, hold up, hold up, hold up. What? You you don't seem to be truth, truthful right I'm now i'm being honest no now you s- no, said no you're that. using your live voice you know back in the day when you used to say that i felt like it was honest now it doesn't really he says i'm using my live voice because when i get nervous my voice shoots up a couple octaves ladies and gentlemen i'll be honest with you that there definitely was a time and place where she used to say that and and didn't use her live voice and now She's using her live voice. I'm, I'm just being gonna honest. I still I after we broke up, I didn't really have sex with other people. I've had sex with like two new people. I think one. One was a girl. And that was a threesome. It didn't really count. I passed out. I was really drunk. Damn. You had a threesome? Uh, kind of? Wow. Wow, dude. I'm cool. not going to expose you. Cool. Cool, guys. Hashtag #hassan Cool. No, I really do love fucking Hassan. He's great. He's a very um. Hold on, you're, you're. I'm not. I'm still on reaction camera. He's a a, a very. How do I just, How would I describe? Where is my? Hold on. I lost my um. I lost my. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I lost the the. Uh, um. What's my opinion on pubic hair? As long as it's not long enough for me to like choke on it or get it caught in my teeth i don't care if you have it um does hassan eat the bussy took a while to register how old were you guys when you dated a chad being insecure his pipe isn't as good as other chad's pipes i wasn't being insecure at all i was just looking for for honesty that's all i'm saying well she does have sex with a bunch of people Hassan no. fucks, dude. We love it. No, uh, I mean originally, um, I gave my crush a threesome and he married someone else. Oh damn, feels bad, man. Um, originally, what do you call it? Uh, originally, the, the reason why I said that is because originally I, I do genuinely believe, even though I didn't believe it uh, when you were saying it at the time, you were you were being honest back then when you used to say. I'm being honest now too. Uh, this is unfair. Okay, okay. This is unfair, because I'm not going to shame myself on this stream right now. Okay, all right, if you say so. Um, okay, what else? What else should we... Any? Do you guys have any other questions? I'm like, I... I, I I'm embarrassed. What? I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. My entire face is red, dude. My face isn't red because I'm a brown person and I'm That's physically true. incapable of blushing. This That's the true. only reason. Because I, my face is like warm, like feel it. I mean, you're far, but yeah. my face is like very warm. I would be blushing if. I oh was my capable. god! You guys want to know something fucking really embarrassing? Okay, because someone said kill, fuck, Mary, Ben Shapiro, Stephen Crowder, Jordan Peterson. Oh, I used there to think Jordan po- Peterson yeah, was hot. Oh, yeah, she said Jordan Peterson was hot, dude. Okay, to be fair, it was before I ever heard him speak. Like, just in, like, passing. Yeah. And I was wrong. Yeah. 
Am I not allowed to be wrong? No, you're not. Not not when it's this wrong, okay? There's wrong. There's like there's wrong. There's um, you know, liking uh, fucking in and out over five guys level of wrong. And then there's I think Jordan Peterson is uh, attractive wrong. So yeah. It's like at the top of it's oh the God, worst. I have the funniest thing to tell. What, you can't tell me on stream? No, I can't. Why? Because don't, you don't. wouldn't want it on stream. Okay, never mind then don't. Um, Wait, they're typing so fast I can't read them. You two are... Janice, uh, that sounds like you have a little daddy thing going on there. Oh! <laughs> that is a king. That is definitely a... Uh, Stop. I have to hide. Oh, now Oh, now you're embarrassed? Now I'm embarrassed. Wait, you wait, no. You two are due for a fuck. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. I um, can't. Someone said daddy, right? Daddy is, is not Don't something... Don't look at me. Wait, who who are some there are like very few people that you've called daddy in your life, I think, right? I have an amazing tweet saved in my drafts about this where I was fucking this dude and I almost called him daddy, but he's not daddy, so I was like, "Oh my god, duh." duh. And I just said, "Duh." I just stopped. She's the one that got you into the daddy thing. Maybe. I will not confirm nor deny. <laughs> Oh, I also you just you just doxed yourself. You said that you're you're calling other dudes daddy now. I didn't. Wow. I said that I almost did. Wow. And I didn't because he wasn't daddy. Wow, dude, that's. I haven't called anyone daddy since we broke up. Mm -hmm. Question for Janice. I don't know if you're atheist or still follow religion, but do you consider yourself to be a Muslim in a cultural sense? Um, culturally, yeah, like ish. Culturally, I would say I'm just more Guyanese because Guyanese people are like, I mean, my family is like half Hindu, half Muslim, not like perfectly down the middle, of course, but they don't really care about that. Like, you know, Muslim and Hindu people hate each other thing. They're not like doing that. So culturally, yeah, I would consider myself Muslim. See, look at the tweet. This is a draft I had saved. Almost called not daddy daddy during sex and call myself with the oh my god do it. I'm just saying. I that didn't call. I didn't do you it. Did, but you almost did. But I did. There you go. But I, I did. No, it's fine. Like I've, I'm just like throw it. I'm in the trash now. I've been thrown into the trash, you guys. That's what it guys, is. No, it's fine. This is so unfair because I can't expose you without exposing myself. What do you mean? Well, I don't even know what you're gonna say. So don't don't put anything like super risky out there. Holy shit! Beyond like this, which is already like insanely so risky. It's like King of the Hill. Hassan is just worried another daddy is going to come dethrone him and his pipe game. I mean, that's gonna happen, obviously. I don't have like a. I don't think that it's uh, you know I'm gonna be daddy forever, especially because like it's not like we. Oh come on, old boy! Every time I try to show, every time just I try to show her. Go. Go. No, no, no. She just like runs away. Go it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Go. Um, if it's on his, uh, must have very low standards. Wow. If it's on his, your dad, I feel sorry for you. you. Must have very low standards. Says Joystar zero zero seven. Yikes. That's um, rude. Yeah, that is. Um, what would you, what advice would you give a girl looking to make Hassan her daddy? Asking for a friend named me. <laughs> Hassan, what? the daddy over. What advice daddy. would you give girls? What advice would that. you give girls about me? Like, how, how can they... You're moving away from the camera again. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm petting Opal. I, um, I know. What advice would I give a girl who, like, wants to date you or wants to hit on you? I don't know. Or make you their daddy? Mm hmm. I don't know. Hassan looks like he's be he likes being treated bad. My face when I look for good Indian porn all the time and been skipping on Janice because I thought she was just tan. Hassan looks like he's been treated, being treated bad. I am being treated poorly right now. Porn star looks like- He only eats like... the one chicken recipe Janice made him. No, 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 no. First of all, no, first of all, I am, I have a very, I, my chicken recipe is separate from, from hers, okay? But you like but, mine better. But no, but she of course makes uh, delicious chicken curry, don't get me wrong. Like, she's very good at uh, uh, making chicken curry. I'm not blushing anymore, it's literally the red from my screen. I don't have my light on me because I put it on, on Janice, and even though she's like, not, a, not only is she not appreciating the light, um, but also Here, moving wait. away from the center of the screen. What if I just... 
no, you don't, that's not working. He's like too little. Um, that is what she said. Um, anyway, very defensive over his chicken. Yeah, no, this is like, uh, this is the most defensive I've ever, this is the most defensive I get uh, out of anything in this chat is the fucking chicken. Um, anyway. How did you two meet? Um, he followed me on Twitter and liked a picture of me and Rocco Sofredi. And I was drunk at wait, 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 and I followed him back and I slid in his DMs. What did I say? Oh, what? Oh, I said, does it, does it, does it count, count as, as a thirst, thirst follow? If I mean, I does it count as a thirst cool? DM? If I just think you're, if I like your brain or something like no, that. No, I said, if I think you're cool, I would never say I like your brain. I don't That's know. Like you said something. You said some fucking cheesy. Okay, it was a cheesy fucking line. Okay, it was a I cheesy know. line. Well, it was. It was like at 3 a.m. in the middle of like the longest award show bullshit that I do every year. Yeah. No. She slid into my DMs and then we talked and then we hung out, and yeah. That's it. Crystal girl for sure. LMAO. <laughs> Rocco Sofredi is a legend. Did you ever end up having sex with him? No, I think I'm going to when I go to uh, Europe in a couple weeks, though. Yeah, she she loves Rocco Sofredi. There's two guys. There's only one guy that I like. Uh, I, I don't, not that I hate him, but I am jealous. Hassan of. is a Leo, and I'm a Cancer. And I fuck. I'm super jealous of what's his name, Manuel Ferrara. The one that you look like. Because she says I look like him, but he does look like Manuel. I want you guys to like stream together. He doesn't he Twitch stream too? I think yeah, he Twitch streams. Yeah, he does. Yeah. He loves video games. Um, Joe Rogan talked about his documentary. What do you mean? Yeah. He's a beast. He beats it up. The best Rocco is legend. Yeah. Um. Anyway, Rocco steal his daddy. No, I'm just he, watching the, the the stream. Yeah, I am too. Um, it's so cold in here, dude. I don't know how you live like this. I hate that. Well, you have I have to. I have to turn on the AC so that it's um, what do you call it? So that it is. Uh, he didn't have an AC when we were dating because it was the winter. Yeah. How does it feel to know countless men have jerked off to your being, Janice? Good. I'm a, a sexual alchemist. I channel the energy. Wait, people are still asking. Tell us how to get Hassan to be our daddy. <laughs> Tell us how to get Hassan to be our daddy. I don't know. I can't even get him to be my daddy again. I'll let you know. This is true. This, this is also true. Janice, plug your stream. Uh, buy my flashlight. That was the corniest thing I've ever heard. Yeah, I know, right? I'm kind of pathetic. Tell Hassan us. Hassan daddy. Hassan baba. Oh my God! Stop! You've never you've never called me Baba. Thankfully, holy I fuck! I did once, and you were like, "That's not sexy." Yeah, that's really weird to me. I don't know. That's not even. Because it's not sexy. It's like yeah, it's, it's like, like Dada. Yeah, it's like father. Yeah. Um, she's holding out. Yeah, they're on to you, dude. They don't. They know that you don't want to. Yeah, you're the one who's. What? What? What am I? What am I holding out on? No, I'm just. Gonna, I was about to expose you as the person who's not as sexually liberated or like as open-minded sexually what? as she claims to be when uh, some when she may or may not have some possessive tendencies. Oh my god, I get I got really jealous. That was what. Okay, can I? I'm just gonna text you it so you can laugh. I'm just hold on, putting hold it on. out there. I have to text us on something. No, I like daddy. I just thought Bubba was like too much. All right, let's hear it. Let's see what you're gonna text me. I have to pee. <laughs> it's funny. The caption was, so this is a black woman? Okay, stop, stop, stop. Jesus Christ, you're you're revealing too much information. That's n Okay. I didn't say anything. I know, it just, that is, even that's enough. I think Hassan needs a mama. Um, I don't know about that. By the way, Why Rocco Sofredi is. LOL, you're in front of me. I know, I don't know. It's just like automatic. <laughs> That's embarrassing. Oh, God. <laughs> that was embarrassing. I know that was embarrassing. I literally typed LOL. Like he texted me LOL. Back. And I didn't even laugh out loud. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm right here. Oh, God. Okay, everyone keeps saying that I'm fucking red. I'm going to show you guys something, okay? Just, just do it. Just take it away. Here. I mean, you know, you're too dark. See? Oh, God damn it. Ah! 
<laughs> no, calm down. I'm not red. I just have no fucking light. And my, my background is red, okay? That's why it looks like I'm red when I'm not. There you go. There you have it, folks. Are you happy? Are you happy to fucking see that I'm not actually red? Anyway, I'm going to put the light back on you because you're prettier than I am, so. Um, hold on. There we go. Wow, so she's racist. I'm N sorry, that was an inside thing. No, 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 it not, has nothing to do with that. Um, not sure about that. You should poll chat. I'm not going to poll my chat on who they think is more attractive because I don't want to get fucking brutalized by my chat as they always do. No, they're going to roast me. Everyone wants you to be their daddy. They're going to be like Hassan's daughter. No, that's daughter. not true. Also, they're right. Actually, What's your Hogwarts like, house? We're like equally beautiful. I don't What's have your... a Hogwarts house because I'm not a fucking nerd. Says wow. the girl with the Harry Potter tattoo. Wow. Holy no, shit. You guys hear that? What the fuck, when dude? When Pottermore came out, I like tried it and I was like, eh. And I gave up. I'm not like a huge Harry Potter stan anymore. I just wow. got a tattoo when I was 18. Is it because of J.K. Rowling and how she's, she's a just, fucking yes. annoying neoliberal? Yes. yes. Um, she should yeah. have just shut up and ate her food. She should have just retired, had a nice life. Janice, is Dumbledore gay? <laughs> is he? <laughs> not to sound rude, but I thought Hassan only dates models. What do you Are Hassan's legs as white as his ankles? I'm so happy that everyone else said that thing, too, because he sent me that picture. And I was like, dude, your ankles need sunlight. Would dump Hassan. He's too straight for me. J.K. Rowling is a turf. Oh, I did not know that. Is Holy she? shit. Fuck. I mean, that's not shocking. She kind of sucks. So. Um. Can you both be my mommy and daddy? I'll be your mommy. <coughs> Couple of years ago, Janice, I saw your in your Snapchat story. I saw you in Japan with some weirdos. What kind of trip was that? Oh man, yeah, I I, I went to Japan and shot porn. I think my name for that stuff is like Janice Smith, but it's on r18.com. Hassan has hijabi ankles. I do have hijabi ankles. <laughs> um, is it true? What? You cheated on your husband? With Dana D'Armond? Who's who's your da husband? Uh, oh, oh, I did a porno like that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. I it's called like, um Lady Daddy. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. I don't skip leg day. I work out I work out my goddamn legs, okay? I, I fucking work out my legs super hard. Okay, I have to pee. I'm gonna Alright, go pee. Don't follow me. I know you want to. I know. Um. Anyway. Oh, I'm gonna move the move the light back to my face for a second. What's up, guys? Are we are we enjoying this conversation? Is this good? No, she's just peeing. She'll be back in a second. Also, every time I hear that music, it makes me think of if I bought the game. It was really similar. I don't know. Would you play it on stream? Janice is like the porn version of Lily Pichu. I don't know who that is. I think, isn't that like a, isn't that one of the streamers that Destiny streams with all the time? All right. We did talk about incest porn a little bit. She doesn't know. She thinks it's weird. Um. Take us on with you. He's in the golden shower. I am not in the golden showers. What is this straw poll? Oh my god, the straw poll is terrible. I thought this was a Christian stream. Son, this is totes awkward. She's destroying you. I got destroyed in this debate, dude. Make her play Red Dead? Fuck no. Because I don't want anyone touching my fucking Red Dead character. I would not make her play Red Dead. Hassan Pokemon Go. Pokemon Let's Go has Saudi spyware that transmits Quran passages subliminally into your brain while you sleep. 
I get my hair cut by this wonderful, uh, a wonderful friend of mine, actually, um, named Madison Blue Nicole. Um, she's dope. Most of your streams are thought provoking. This one is taught provo thought provoking. Yeah. Yeah, this is an Islamic stream, so better red, better redead than dead or red. I don't know what that means. What a name. Sexuality isn't your strong suit. You should stick to intellectual discussions. Uh, I disagree with you, friend. Um, oh, hard safe so it doesn't affect you. Yeah, you're right. I could do that technically. I could have her. Do you want to play Red Dead Redemption? Me? Yeah. Uh, is it really a game? It, it looks like it's not a game. It looks like you just do stuff. It's not a game. It's a way of life. Yeah, what do you, why do you know that? How do you know that? Um, I watched my friend's boyfriend play it. Uh -huh. What? Come here. Come here. This is like, okay, I'm home. I'm away. Hassan was codification the cause of the downfall of Muslim government in the Ottoman Empire. What codification? I don't know. No, it was because we were. Sorry, everyone. I have my period. I had to change my pants on. Oh God, ne so they can't see you. They they can't hear you either. Uh, it's on IRL right now. Hold on, I'll, I'll I'll turn it back to you right now. Um, wait. No, you have to like center yourself on camera. You're like. You, I can't fucking see it. I know, but you're like professional. Go down. You gotta get lower. There you go. And then here, you need the light. I'm gonna give you back the light. <clears throat> But Hassan, for real, is going to massage that prosh. Sexuality isn't really your strong shoot. You should stick to intellectual discussions. I think that people who aren't comfortable with sexuality should talk more about it. And I think that we're both moderately comfortable. I think I'm very comfortable with my sexuality. I'm pretty comfortable. Yeah. No? No, yeah. I, I think that you are. I just think that we hold people to an impossible standard of eloquence and... Um, articulation when it comes to something so deeply personal and that varies you know like i think the way that we get over sex being so taboo is by everyone talking about it or everyone who wants to talking about it rather hassan is janice the best at sex out of everyone you've slept with try not to sound sarcastic when answering yeah tell the truth so what is the truth I don't know. Oh my god. Is wow. it? Is she? Is she the best? No, I'm kidding. No, she is the best. She is, literally. That's wow. not a joke. I feel like he's lying now. I'm not lying. I'm being honest. I'm being super honest. Janice, can you talk about how Pornhub and MindGeek has devalued the industry and bottomed out salaries for performers? Yeah, I mean, that happened. Also, the industry is just stupid. Everyone is stupid. Everyone is bad at their job. Um, people didn't think that internet porn was going to take off, so they didn't invest money in it. And they let MindGeek get um, ahead of the game and create this, you know, conglomerate of an impossible to break down, like, Medusa head of porn sites. It sucks, but a lot of performers are pivoting to making their own content. Which is really cool, like OnlyFans, private Snapchats, many vids, and clip other clip sites. I think it's, I think we're on the precipice of a porn resurgence, because the previous generation is honestly dying out. Like the porn industry as we know it is very new in terms of, you know, the internet and shit like that. Like. But it's good, right? Because they're bringing their, their, um, you know, they're bringing power back to the worker by by owning their own uh, intellectual property, right? Yeah, it just sucks because of um, the discrimination that we face as sex workers. There are not many places that we can sell our content and actually expect revenue because people don't want to do business with us. They think that our dollars are higher risk 
for it a higher risk of chargebacks because people will be like, oh, I, I yeah, I bought that porn, but uh, actually I didn't mean to buy it. Can I have my money back? And they get to consume the product and then they get a refund. And it happens more often than, you know, I'd like. Which question? Can y'all stop sucking each other off and roast each other? I am. Oh, Janet, you won the poll, apparently. So Izzy put a straw poll. Um, and uh, the results say that 56% said, who do you want, Janice Griffith? 44% said Hassan Daddy. And out of 85, uh, out of 85 votes... You won. That you are. You, wow. you are the victor. If you could only like frame yourself appropriately, like maybe move a little bit further to your left. Maybe if I could see the fucking monitor. I, you can't. Okay. This is. There you go. That's perfect. Dick bag. Um. I liked Owen Gray for a while. We were friends, but recently I found out that he put someone's video that he shot with on Pornhub because they didn't text him back, like out of revenge. And I thought that that was wrong. Um, so I don't consider Owen a friend of mine anymore. Which sucks, because he was nice. But I think that that behavior was really suspicious and wrong. And I've seen a lot of other models talk about him, unfortunately. I do believe that other people deserve more flack for worse shit, though. So I'd rather not focus on, like, someone else. Alright, you answer the questions while I go pee now. Okay. I'm just gonna, like exclusively put the camera on you hold on i would um, i wish that queer porn was all good and dandy but i feel like well not i feel like a lot of lesbian porn is made by men for the male gaze which sucks because i would love i would love to do a girl girl scene where i didn't have to do any fucking scissoring i hate scissoring i hate it it gives me really bad razor burn um I did shoot while, while I have been in committed relationships, and it doesn't really affect the relationship. You shot when we how. were dating. Yeah, I shot when we, when we were dating, but I wasn't shooting a lot, and I remember that You shot I, one time. Yeah, I missed fucking you more than I liked shooting that day. Aw. Aw. Stop. How much do you think the patriarchy influences women's sexual desires? Do you think many women would prefer submission if it weren't for a culture that desires them to be so? Yes, I think that women would want to be submissive without the um, cultural influence because a lot of men are also extremely submissive. You just don't see it as much. You don't hear about it as much. It's a more shameful, taboo sort of kink that's pushed deeper, you know, under the bed, under the carpet, whatever you want to say. It's not about, for, can you not provide a specific stipulation before purchase saying you not allow refunds of any kind? If we're using a certain payment processor, like PayPal, a lot of people just are not sex work friendly. I don't know of any payment processors that actually allow sex work stuff. Janice, why are there still performers charging more to work with performers of color slash interracial? Because people are racist, and their agents are perpetuating this forever long idea that when you fuck a black guy your white fans will get upset so there are two kinds of interracial reactionary fans excuse me and one of them is likely a cuckold who loves it he's like fuck yeah like i love watching you take that big black bull like finally a real man fucks you and this is because he's a racist who has this idea that Black men are superior, but only in a way that feeds his self-humiliation fetish. And then there's another kind of person who thinks that because you've touched a black person, you're tainted and no good forever, which is just nonsense, crazy town. Janice, are you friends with any trans performers? Yeah, a handful. There's a a lot of um, separation within the industry. So, like, I don't know a ton of gay porn stars and I don't know a ton of trans performers, but I do know a handful like Chanel Santini, uh, Venus Lux, um, Natasia Dreams, 
I'm trying to think. I forget everyone's names because they all kind of sound the same except for mine. How hard do you guys have to be in this chat room that you want Hassan to be your daddy? This dude is off his rocker. He's about three steps away from being in a padded cell with a straight jacket. Leave Hassan alone. The 16 percent. Scissor me, Cersei. Fuck Ivanka Trump. I get it's the whole stick of most porn settings that the girl gets exploited or whatever, but all these teen casting BS seems so weird to me. Yeah, it does seem weird. Um, my porn name is Janice Griffith. Does it affect the sex life, though, between the partner and you? It, it just depends on the person. Hassan is not a cock. I think it's prejudice against sex work and that people are using their stigma and their prejudice against sex work to feel guilt and shame and they're like, oh fuck, I regret buying this thing and now I'm going to use this tool to get my money back and fuck that person over. I don't really choose who I shoot porn for in terms of like, I don't seek people out asking to shoot for them. People book me for shoots. Bottom shaming. <laughs> he just went and looked at himself instead. Should I turn the camera on you no, loving dogs? Try to mess Janice, would you ever work with a trans performer? Totally fine if you wouldn't. I don't necessarily say that it would be totally fine if I wouldn't. I do agree that people are allowed to make whatever choices they want with their bodies and their, you know, sexual activities. But, yeah, I would work with a trans performer. I just don't want to do any, like, super exploitive, exploitative scenes. I don't know. It makes me feel bad. That's why I also waited until someone wanted to shoot me with a black guy but promised to not make it about race and promised that they wouldn't market it as interracial or anything like that because Hello? That, it was really important to me. I don't, I don't like the fetishization of it. Is Fish <laughs> choking? Yeah, he's fine. He's just, he's just coughing. Oh! Hold up. <laughs> Uh, let me just... I'm still, like, a brand new dog mom. Like, if that happened to Opal, we would be halfway to the vet. Oh, no, I know. We've had this conversation before where you're, like, freak. I mean, I guess it was a little different because, like, in that instance... She was she had, sick. Yeah, she she had had a lot of they fucking They told me rocks. she was going to die if she didn't have surgery. I know, I know, I know. You made me feel so bad, by the way. And I was really worried. Wait, is it echoing? You're echoing on her mic? What the fuck? Why? Why? I don't think it's a moral reason I can't date a sex worker, but because I'm so invested in the sciences and correcting the disparity of environmental injustice, I could never date a sex worker. Need someone whose life work is about that stuff. To be fair, sex workers' life work is more about correcting um, injustices than almost anyone else, but you don't need to tell sex workers that you wouldn't date them because likely they're not asking to date you anyway. And you should apply that to all of the other fields of work that you wouldn't date in. What are you doing over there? I don't even know what Opal's doing half the time, dude. I would never date a Trump supporter. She likes being in the closet if she doesn't have a bed. Are you and Hassan the Adam? Oh no. Are you and Hassan the Adam 22 of Twitch? Fuck Adam 22. Wow. Wow. What was the backlash or what did August Ames suicide do to the industry? Did I know her? Yes, I knew August. She was a dear friend of mine. Um, her suicide was really hard and jarring for us. And it sucked. It sucked a lot. And I wish there was more that we could have done. It was really hard for a lot of us. 
And it made a lot of us worse. And I see performers who are getting, you know, rightfully getting roasted for saying racist things. And they use her death as an excuse and say things like, well, well, what if I killed myself, you know? And I think that that's pathetic and horrible. Oh my God, what do you want? What do you want? Is it a walk? I don't think you need to go for a walk. I just don't think you do. I just don't. So there's echo when I talk now. Is that what's going on? Um, because her microphone is picking me up too. Yeah, fuck. Okay, hold on. I'll, I have to fucking... Are we going to stop? No, no, no. We don't have to stop. I just like have to re-put the gain filter or like this noise gate and noise suppression or whatever. I think this is better. No, um, I don't prefer watching gate. Can you hear me now when I talk on your on your microphone? Nope, it's gone. All right, noise. There we go. It's gone. Um. What oh, was the Figaro, are you talking about with Poopo? Janice, can you confirm it's on his vault cell, not in cell? Yes, I can confirm. This is like this is just it, this is bullshit. Okay, um, this is bullshit. Like, it is a fact. It is a factual statement that... Do you think you'll be sad when Hassan starts dating Lindsay Pillow? Oh, my God. No, Lindsay is actually a good friend of mine. I, told I was going to say, I was going to say, they're just really good friends. Yeah, she's dope. Like, stop erasing Hassan's identity, really? Oh, she's getting cut off now? What? Oh, fuck. Hold on. How is your emotion condition? I mean, can you fall in love with somebody? Because I think being a porn star must damage the rich emotion. Oh, now can you, you get rid talk, of that person? You got to talk... Wait, yeah, we can. I don't know who said that, but um, uh, I can't even find her. One of the moderators will get her, but um, uh, you're, I have to fix your 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 microphone now. Like I put a noise gate on it, and now like uh, just do it. I, you don't need to explain it to me. I mean, you just need to get closer to your microphone and like really talk into it, or n not better? the spit guard. No, no, pulling the spit Is guard. Is this better? That's actually a lot better. Yeah, keep doing that. Yeah, that's fine. I just got rid of the spit guard. I don't really. Um, that's true. Yeah, you don't. I hate spit. You fucking hate spit. Um, the sounds all weird. Still cutting out. Okay, hold on, hold on. All right, fuck, dude. God damn it. All right, I'll delete the noise gate, and then you know what? I'll delete the noise gate, and then I'll talk very lowly in a low audio. Have you topped the song? So you guys won't be able to. What does top mean? What? Like oh, a, oh. like topped. Like oh, oh, like oh. when you're a bottom and Oh yeah yeah yeah, okay. No. I'm I not think like topped it. off. I thought that was like what it oh, was. Oh, like get top. Yeah, that's why I was like, yes, obviously. Hassan, would you date a porn star again? <laughs> uh I don't know how to answer that question because because no, Hassan hates me. Wow. Wow. This is not this is not true at all. Um, the echo was fixed before you fucked up her mic, just FYI. Well, that's because I was talking in a lower voice. That's why. If I start yelling, you'll hear it. Love um, you, Izzy Bear. Hold on, hold on. Love I, to see Hassan struggle. Me too, Odd Rice. Everyone fucking so every like I've 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 never wished anyone ill, and like and yet my entire stream fucking hates me every night, dude. This every is night. this is exactly what it's like to be a cam girl, Hassan. You're a cam girl. I I like, am. No, I know. I'm I'm yeah. posting you on my Instagram. Hassan, you'd make more as a porn star than you do at TYT. That's facts, actually. Yeah, you're that not is, wrong. That is factually correct. I, I know that. Um, Look at this cam girl. Look at this cam girl wow. streaming. Don't be, don't be making fun of uh, <laughs> sex workers, okay? Like, don't stigmatize sex workers, please. <laughs> wow. You guys see that? Expose, dude. Expose her, everybody. Um, Hold on, I'm, I'm Instagramming. Male porn stars make a lot less than female. Um, no, yeah. they not over the course of their career because their career is significantly longer and they work way more often. So there are probably, for every hundred female performers, there's one male performer. So male performers will work every single day, multiple times a day if they want to and they're good at their job, while female performers don't. So, yes, female performers' rates are higher, but because our career longevity is so much lower. 
What is what is the link? Morally, do you think porn com? has an impact? Twitch dot twitch.tv slash Hasanabi. Does mor- morally do you think porn has an impact on society, positive or negative? I think porn is neutral. Like porn is neutral and it is what you want it to be. Also, can you look at fish? Um, no. I, no, don't don't move the camera yet. I was, it's like barely I wasn't there. going to. I was saying like you with your eyes. Oh yeah. Look at your I son. Am, I am looking at him. Janice, do you have a plan for after your career? Says Gino Torst. Um, what's your plan for after your career, dude? That's another thing that people always ask porn performers, but don't ask anyone else. Like, why are people so concerned with my retirement plans, but not that of, like, literally anyone else? Fair. Isn't it a bit harder to be a male porn actor, though, mostly? Male performers don't get the same stigma that female performers th- get, though. Like, they they get high fives, not death threats. People ask Twitch streamers that literally all the time. Yeah, right? Yeah, because your retirement will come sooner than most people said. Um, and Tell that uh, to Nina Hartley. I ask NBA players about their retirement plans. Porn does propagate harmful stereotypes. So do all television shows and all movies and video games and songs and every other kind of media that's produced and consumed. It's not porn specific. If you want to talk about pornography things, you have to be conscious of all of the other stuff. By what? the way, Dark Woods, uh, 1989, uh, she answered that question already. Yes, Pornhub pays. And actually, I can confirm this, pays really well, too, in comparison to YouTube. Like, the CPMs are higher. And, um, yeah, you get more money on Pornhub, probably because more people consume or, or people consume porn all the fucking time, no matter what uh, they claim that they don't, including Ted Cruz. Are you still on your Instagram? Are no, you- I'm reading the... I'm reading the chat. Okay, get get to the middle again. I like, middle up oh, there. You go. Your son pushed me out of and the middle. And you got to get higher too. Mm-hmm. You're like just a frame. Up oh, there it is. Oh, That's perfect. I'm dog whispering, you guys. I'm That's true. sorry. I'm My son is so such a fucking dick. <laughs> yeah, you're right. This is he why is they broke dick. up. No, no. You're right. Wow. Oh wow, really? You're just gonna sit here and and fucking let people let people. How many lie times like did this? you break up with me? I don't know. Uh, like like 5. Yeah, like 3. I guess. This is why he was kicked out of Turkey. If Fish loves her, we stand her. Okay, um, I'm moving the camera. Hassan's going to yell at me. Oh, Jesus Christ. But here look. We, here we go, dude. This is my son. Hi Fish. Hi my boy. Hi. And this is my girl Opal. Can you see them? I can't see. No, oh, yeah, Opal's butt. You can kind of see her. Hi. Janice, run away with fish, please. Hassan says that if something happens to him, I get fish. Oh yeah, for sure, one hundred percent. Out of everyone, out of everyone in my life, the one, the the person that is taking care of fish the absolute best, without a doubt. Like, this is not like a joke. This isn't me just like sucking up. One, I mean, I would, I have no incentive to suck up to you anyway. <laughs> after you fucking shitted and farted all over me, uh, but. Uh, on my stream of all places but yeah no she's the best at at taking care of fish like 100 percent. that's my son yeah i mean she literally went and got a a a fucking uh she she went and got a a pit bull yeah i i got my dog because we broke up and i had a hole in my heart where fish used to be yeah so i mean luckily there you go fish is like making people adopt pit bulls okay um, I mean, someone keeps asking, is Hassan you, bad at breaking up? And was I bad at breaking up? I think it was really fucking good at breaking up. What? You blocked my phone number. Oh, oh my God. That is, that was, okay. First of all, that was warranted and you know that was warranted. I'm not going to talk about what, I'm not the, gonna talk about what it, the specific but, details are. But. No, 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 no. That was, really? Just really? Like, I'm just saying. I don't think you're great at breaking up. Also, by the way. Also, when we tried to break up and your, then we didn't break me, up. Me blocking your phone numbers is more about you than it does about me. I'm just going to put that out there. Okay? Don't. 
Don't fucking. You blocked my phone number before I texted you. You preemptively blocked yes, my phone number. Yes, because we're not going to talk about it. We're, we're not going to Hassan talk. is bad at breaking up. I'm That's... worse at breaking up, but he's bad also. These are lies. I'm really good at breaking up. I'm like, Hassan I mean, obviously I'm favorite... good at breaking up. We're fucking friends. Like, you're here right now. Yeah, I mean, we're friends. Hassan is a nice boy. Yeah, there you go. Please. What are you, are you hiding? A little bit. I'm trying to hide my shame. Mom, Dad, this, please don't do this. Does this on break up over text? No. No. I no, it was in person. Yeah. Press F for Hassan. Hassan, nice boy chat. <laughs> I can we can see the man breaking down on stream right yeah, now. Yeah, because you're lying. You're <laughs> lying. It's not that you're lying, you're just like not revealing key details, and I don't want to reveal it either. Um What'd you think about the sex in the show, like, sex in the shows like Game of Thrones? No, porn is not setting standards of attractiveness because there is literally pornography specifically made of uglier people. There are porn sites that capitalize off of the, like, ugly girl. I don't watch Game of Thrones. I think it's lame. Wow. 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 You're you're out here. You don't follow her on Instagram. Do you really still not follow me on Instagram? <gasps> wow, really? Still? Wow. 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 I'm done. We're done with this conversation. Wow. Who the Thank fuck? You. Who is the nosy Thank Millie you. over here? That's Thank you, like, Lola. Wow, dude. What are you guys doing over here? Janice, please verbally abuse him. She is ver verbally abusing me right now. Honestly, we... Hassan being vulnerable makes him so much hotter. Thank you. Thank you for thinking that. I wish I felt that way right now. If you're not breaking up with her because she fucks with other guys, so how the fuck can you find a more logic reason to break up? Can you just block that person? I hate who, them. Who is it? Who is ZZ the Brain. That's their name. Just block them. I don't, I don't know where... I, it's not coming up for me. What the fuck? Why am I not seeing these? Uh, this is like the 10th shitty thing that they've said. I'm I don't tired. know where they're at. I, I, it's not coming up. But I, I, where am I? Oh, there it is. Oh, so one of the moderators got to it. Thank you. There, Izzy did it. Um, I'm squeezing my hog to Hassan right now, and I'm going to keep doing it. Even How good of a may. boyfriend was Hassan from 1 to 11? One time he picked me up and put me in the shower when I was too depressed to shower. It was very sweet. I would say 11. Oh, thank God. Okay. I thought you were going to be like, you fucking suck. Like, and then everyone's going to hate me. No, you're the best. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you for saying that. Um, <clears throat> Do porn sets have craft services? No, they have water bottles and like granola bars if you're lucky. Some people get like food, food, but only if they really love you. 6'4", 230 pounds of lies and heartbreak. If you don't follow me on Instagram right now, I'm leaving. Okay, I'm going to follow you. Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. I'm ashamed. I'm what? ashamed that I was tricked into this. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. No, verbally abuse him more. Please, I'll slide you $5. What is this? X-Biz? Wow, you brought Y two Y two K two Y as your date to Expo's official. I see, I see you. Don't act like you would go if I asked you. I would. I still would go to a, a porn gala. <clears throat> would you? Yeah, I would. I literally didn't ask you because I didn't think you would want to. No, I would. I told you I would go. Yeah, when um, we were dating. Now that we're broken up and we don't even hang out, I didn't think that you would want to I mean, go I would to an still event go. with it's me. It's like a, it's an event. Do you want to go to the AVN Awards with me? Maybe. Okay. Um, Janice needs to be on the stream all the time now. She's awesome. You definitely have to look at the numbers of what porn is most popular and compare to the general unhealthy Janice, standards. Janice, do you believe in marriage? Yeah. I love weddings. They make me cry. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You can tell Hassan is the one that has always broken, has always broken up with Janice. Yeah. Oh, yes. whatever, dude. It was for good if reason. If Hassan was, was a bagel, you, what kind would he be? Relationship it was for your best thing. I think Hassan would be an everything bagel with onion cream cheese. <laughs> this is my favorite. That's literally my favorite, too. Is it? 
Yeah. I did not know that. Yeah. Janice, what do you think about hentai? Um, whatever. Re- the, rename the stream humiliation fetish. Yeah. Does Hassan believe in marriage? Um, yeah. I do. Saat biri yağdırıyorum seni kanka. Kendimi açık görüşlü sanardım. Yadırgıyorum seni kanka. Kendimi açık görüşlü sanardım. Aa, işte görüyorsun, öğreniyorsun bu şekilde. Uh, benim mikrofonumun... Yeah, I have a, I have an echo on my microphone. Holy shit, I said that in Turkish first. <laughs> um, yeah, I was like, are you going to translate for the rest yeah. of us? Janice, did you come out come out on that video of porn stars that was ragging on Ted Cruz that was awesome uh no I don't think I did I don't really participate in like recording videos to be put in compilations with other stuff this is this is like top uh top level porn star privilege right there you heard it here first folks Janice Griffith no one asked me no one asked me to be in it also I'm just saying would you say uh, every porn star has herpes? Does Hassan shout Turkish stuff when he orgasms? <laughs> <laughs> no. No. Janice, I've noticed more and more performers are growing their bush out. Is it officially back in style? If so, I'm for it. So the bush has been back for like seven years. It's It's been for back. For you, it's fucking been back too. Excuse a- you. I was clean shaven for like a whole year no up until gay. two weeks ago. No, okay. <laughs> Hassan hates pubic hair because he's not a feminist. Yeah, I, I don't. I Whatever. It's my preference. I don't like um I don't like super hair. I don't like a lot of hair. I don't like hair on my body either. Does Hassan shout out his subs when he orgasms? Yes, I yeah, absolutely do, which is why you need to subscribe. Uh, I always will think about you, and I will when I'm coming, I will yell out your subscription. Um, Hassan, if you had the opportunity to redesign the TSA. This TSA. is no longer a political chat room. It is a political chat room, though. We're just like, this is the first time that I'm on here, so you guys are getting all your sex bullshit out. You know, Hassan and I talk about politics and, like, very real-world things all the time. Yeah. This is true. Um, I mean, Janice's existence is political, you know? She understands that. Hassan DM'd me on Instagram before we ever met. This is true. This is true. Because one of his producers was like, what, what was I doing? I was getting people to vote? Yeah, you did a go out to vote campaign. Um, or like you did like a, you, you were like, I'll send you guys nudes for free if you go out and vote and you should send me proof that you voted. Which is why I was like, oh, that's really cool. And then I was going to shoot a video about it. Um, but then you never responded to my DM. Cause I, and, <laughs> and then you t- DM'd me on Twitter. I know, I didn't, I didn't see your DM. I didn't see it. Yeah. Yeah, I I had like I had like really uh you know honest uh honest and 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 halal intentions when I approached you, madam. Yeah, no. And I had I never actually I'd never actually seen a, a Janice Griffith uh porno that either. That you know of. What? That I know of. Fair. Oh, 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 Opal. Look at this. Get up. Opal. No, get her off. Get her off the bed. No, get off. Get off the bed. Oh my god, she's so oh my god, she's exactly like you, I swear to god. This is ridiculous. Like your dog is Let me show her fish's bed. Come here. Come here. Anyway. That face when people vote for nudes? What do you mean? No! No! no. Oh my god. <laughs> She just yeah, fucking girl. you turn your back and then she jumped on the, she just jumps on the bed. Get her a small bed so she can hang out on stream. Um, because we just took them to the dog park. That's why they're really fucking dirty. I want to I want to shower fish before I let him back on the bed as well. Oh, she was giving away nudes for votes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. Um, They're snuggling. It's really cute. Okay, you're not even on the cam. Like, you're not even near the camera. Like, there you go. That's perfect. I'm perfect. There you go. Um. (laughs) 
but it's like Hassan's content is 6'3 and Destiny is like 5'6. What does that even mean? Wait, know. is she in the house with you? Yeah, we're like, like, there's just a computer between us. Yeah, no, she is. We're like, <laughs> no, because people, I have guests on the stream yeah, all I the know. time and, and it, it, it looks identical to the way it looks right now. For a porn star, Janice seems to have problems working the camera angles. I agree. I agree. I can't see the, what I look like. It's true. Um, you guys are so rude. By the way, Janice, I love your hair so much. Uh, I'm glad that it's growing back. I think it was a little it was a little extra when you like cut it all the way, when you buzzed the back of it to get a tattoo, I guess. That but, was just for the tattoo. It's so yeah. long now. It's like yeah, about your length. You can't even tell. Look. Yeah, no, I know. I, it was just like it was. I literally when you, when only you, did it to when get you a tattoo. Fucking, when you shaved the back of it completely, I was like, oh Jesus, like that's. I, I was wondering if you were gonna. Uh, I was gonna what? Uh, you fully buzz it. No, I have a weird shaped head. I would never go bald. I would look so stupid. Um, but yeah. That's the whole reason I would never go bald, just because I would look stupid. Janice, how much did you love Cowboy Bebop? I have never watched Cowboy Bebop. Yeah, she doesn't watch a lot. Alex, of I'm streaming right now. I can't talk. But yeah. Huh? <laughs> God damn it, Hassan! Ask her my question, please. Uh, I don't know. I, I she she answered the which question? The I think it was a retirement portfolio question. Like, do you have a retirement portfolio or something like that? I um, have a retirement plan. I just don't feel like no, uh, yeah. Uh, validating you what's by bladman giving it to you. do you mean bad man what is your favorite anime um i don't really watch anime either i just like studio ghibli stuff and i watched sailor moon when i was a kid but i'm not like a weeb hassan's the weeb I don't know if I'm that much of a weeb. I mean, I like anime, but... You have Death Note comics on your nightstand. Okay, I like anime. I mean, I just, like, don't want to say that I'm a weeb because, like, people get fucking really touchy about that. There's this dude, the progressive voice, that comes in here every fucking... Every day and asks me, like... Um... That, that asks me fucking what my favorite, like, Dragon Ball Z character is. And if I don't give him an answer immediately, he gets, like, super fucking angry at me. The black That's one. why I, like, hate... That's why I hate saying, like, oh, yeah, I love anime. Because, like, really nerdy people get so upset. Like, really fucking... People that are really into anime get so incredibly touchy. No, when you're don't. like, oh, how fucking dare you say you're an into anime and you can't, like, tell me what happened in uh, season 32, episode 5 of whatever the fuck anime that I like to watch. <laughs> she doesn't like anime? Never mind. This is the last time she's on the stream. It's not that I don't like it. It's just that I'm not, like, an anime person. And like Hassan said, I'm not going to, like, claim it and let people get upset when I don't love it as much as they think I'm supposed to. Yeah. Gatekeeping bullshit. Exactly. What is this? What is what? Oh, hi. The tables have turned. No, but she's staring at me. No. Are you into movies, Janice? I like movies. Was her not liking anime one of the reasons you broke up with her? No. Anime? More like anime. Oh, wow. Wow. Batty A. Peeler, you fucking banned, dude. No, that's I'm not I'm my one. baby. I'm my booba boy. Oh, my baby boy. I hope I'm, I'm my sweet Goro. Oh, my sweet Goro. Go to bed. Go to bed. Um, Janice, what are some good male performers to look for, like, that I can watch and know isn't the creep IRL, says Juliana Bruno. Oh, God. Uh, Isaiah Maxwell. Um. I'm gonna get jealous. Ryan McLean. Mm, I'm blanking really hard. There are a lot of amazing male performers. I just, like... It's like when someone asks you about your interests or about yourself and you're like, oh, I forget everything that's ever happened to me. Um, am I still friends with Adam, 22? Fuck no. How's my boy Danny Mountain, says supposedly fun. Danny Mountain freaked out on me on Twitter one time, so I don't personally like him, but I used to have really good sex with him before that. J-Mac is a nice dude, actually. I like J-Mac.
Isaiah. Oh, I hate to. I hate that two tone Malone dude. <laughs> I know exactly who you're talking about. Yeah, I don't know too much about Danny Mountain. Johnny Sins is a great dude. Super nice. Johnny heart. Sins is the fucking legend. Did you remember? Did I, did I send you that cameo thing that he did? Yeah. When he's like, it's no nut November. And if you fucking nut, I'll fuck your. He's like, I'll fuck like your, your mother. Sister, your and I'll mom. Sick you, sit, fuck your sister. It's so funny. Oh my God. Um, attention all epic Fortnite gamers. I fucking love Johnny Sins. I follow him. He's the only male porn star I follow. Him he and was his the girl. only, technically, I guess he was the only porn star I followed on, on Instagram until like five minutes ago. <laughs> oh. I'm so mad about until that. Until you guys expose me that so I fucking, I, I, okay, I, I followed you back and now I. I have you muted, so I wouldn't know if you. Wow. Okay. Okay. All right. That's nice of you, I guess. That's cool. I'm protecting my feelings. Um, okay. Uh, have you ever worked with Mick Blue? Mick Blue is really nice. He's a sweet, sweet boy. No, I have not done double anal penetration. I can not even do regular anal. My friend did a shoot with Scoreland and worked with Jamie. Hassan is so trash, Janice. Why do you ever bother with him? <laughs> I like it. How could you not love him? <laughs> Oh, God. Yeah, Mick is a really nice dude. Manuel is really nice, too. No, we don't talk about him on this stream. <laughs> get back and center yourself again, please, madam. Go f get a fucking tripod for your webcam. Yeah, whatever. Um, you know, like the one that you have okay. for yourself. No, but, uh, yeah, because it's like, that was the other, that was uh -huh. a camera that I uh -huh. didn't steal from uh -huh. the Young Turks. Uh-huh. Um. <laughs> Sandrock, I keep telling you guys. Because you want a girl, a girl that does anal, the date a trans girl. They're right. That's Just kidding. Not all trans girls desire penetration, but good joke. Well, Sandrock is a trans what? woman. That's why. She's Brian like that. Madison freaks me the fuck out. I he, no comment. I don't know who that is. I don't even know who Ryan Madison is. It's like porn fidelity and teen fidelity dot com. Hmm. If it's not check, I'm not into it. You know this. <laughs> I know. <laughs> if it's not check pickup porn, like I'm not even about that lifestyle. <laughs> that's probably why. That's probably why I didn't watch your pornos. Uh, trans girls that I top made. are reserved for other trans girls. <clears throat> I don't know if it's been answered yet, but which porn stars are head cases or straight up nuts? Don't, if you don't want to comment on it, you don't, don't have to. I don't say anything. Okay. Oh, my um, God. There's one girl, though, Serenity Hayes. She literally, there's a video of her laying in bed, and she's drunk, and she's like, those dirty fucking, she's saying the N-words, and she's like, at least Mexicans work, but the oh, dirty I know what you're talking about. N-words just, um, I just collect welfare. It's so crazy. She's changed her name like four times now. Um, it's, it's absurd. Do you get paid more for doing certain sex acts compared to others? Yes. Different sex acts pay differently. Um, it just feels weird to top someone that's more masculine than you. Like, it makes you feel extremely masculine. It's weird. I love to feel um, masculine. <laughs> not going to lie. What? Nothing. What? I'm not, like, I don't know. I. I it's funny because I... I your size you're the masculine one yeah, in and our your relationship. your size comparison to mine is that's why I was like laughing. Yeah, I mean, like in me and Hassan's relationship dynamic, he's the masculine one. <laughs> um, but I I like to play around with masculinity and like whatever. Did Hassan not satisfy that enough? What do you mean? No, Hassan is great. He's a great fuck. Um, Look, his face is red again. No, it's... God damn it. It's in your head, guys. It's because my fucking Communist Party background is, like, uh How common red. is hard drug use among porn stars? Netflix docs is fairly common even as a coping mechanism. I think it's less common than you might think and just as common as hard drug use in regular people's lives that you don't really know about. You know, like, when your dear friend overdoses and you had no idea that they had a drug problem, shit like that. What's something that we wouldn't expect about Hassan? 
Um, he poops with all his clothes on. I think going to the bathroom naked is weird, okay? He, like, if we had sex, he would, like, put his clothes back on to go poop. I just, yeah, it's normal to to want to not feel compromised. Yes, I even put on pants before I go to the bathroom, okay? Everybody calm down. Are those the glasses you got after you tried on a bunch of mine? Uh, no, I don't. I, oh, maybe. Actually, yeah. I got, like, no the Warby Hoth, Parker set weird. at home, and you were trying them on while I was at the farmer's market. I can't, I can't poop naked. You guys are crazy. Like, that's a weird thing to do. Is he a never nude? He is a never nude. No, bathrooms are cold. I'm not a never nude. I'm, like, naked a, a, a good amount. Only it's during just... sex. I feel like you put your clothes back on immediately after. Okay, maybe I am a never nude, okay? Whatever. It's okay. It's because he still thinks he's fat. Um, it's cold when you're naked. Thank you, Katie. I live with New York roaches, so I have to poop with clothes to feel safe. I mean, I grew up in a cold place, and I'm like, so I'm moving in a couple months, and I'm going to get a fucking robot toilet like the ones in Japan. Like, I'm getting a heated toilet seat. I'm getting a heated bidet. Were you going to New York? I thought you were going to... I'm, well, I'm moving to Vegas. But, yeah. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to Europe in a couple weeks. Oh, like, yeah, that's In a week true. and a half. Janice, how often do you get recognized in public? Are they nice and they keep their space? Mostly people just look at me really intensely. They don't come up to me as often. Um, my rule is just, like, don't be weird. It's totally cool if you want to come up, say hi, take a picture, but um, just don't be weird. Hassan gets recognized more than I do, which is so nice because when we would go out, people would be like, oh, my God, are you Hassan? And I could just, like, shrink into the background. It was amazing. Why do you want a heated toilet seat? How is that comfortable? Oh my god! Are you kidding? You haven't lived if you've never fucked with a heated. Have you toilet never seat? been upset when you sat down and it was cold? Oh my god! Yeah, you guys are crazy. Heated Dude, toilet seats are the shit. When I was in Tokyo, like I, we went to this like outskirts mountain city town, and on the way there, I had to sit on my first unheated toilet seat, and I like sat and I was offended. I was like, "What is this? You're not gonna wash my ass for me? Rude." Yeah, but days are great. Like I, I honestly, that's Adam like, twenty two is a bitch. A warm bidet is like a gentle kiss from God. <laughs> Hard agree. How difficult is it to make in the porn industry? Did I go to college? No. Janice, your glasses are really smudgy. Oh, they're always dirty. Do you have tissues over there, Hassan? No. There's oh, I mean, there's like regular napkins. That's fine. They're mm, here. I can't read the stream right now because I can't see for shit. You really hate Adam22. Do you hate his girlfriend as much? Yes. Yeah, but I'm not going to give her as much shit because I think women deserve better. But Lena, um, there was a, one point on Twitter when she was like, I'm never going to do porn. I just don't do porn. And we were like, hey, like, you literally make pornogra pornographic content. Like, you make porn. And she was like, no, I don't. So I just don't really appreciate people who are, like, tangentially involved in sex work. And she's past tangentially involved. She does sex work. Who try to act like they're better than sex work. I think it's an internalized shame thing. Link 95 Janice, says... how often how are cream pies faked? Okay, yeah, you answer that one first. Um, all the time. All softcore porn, those are fake cream pies. We call them fake fibs or yeah yeah I, don't, I forget why we call them fibs but i don't want to talk about adam 22 i don't need to talk about him don't google him he sucks he's an old white dude who talks about hip-hop and he platformed um triple x temptation or whatever he does a bunch of bullshit you get a lot of haters I don't care. not from my chat obviously i don't think anyone here gives a shit but um, if they get clipped out but yeah, uh, there's a lot of fake cream pies, but there's a lot of real cream pies, too. I don't do cream pies in porn, though, because I, I don't. You don't do cream pies? No. Really? Yeah. Interesting. I didn't it's know It's something that. I save for special people in my life. Oh, wow. Off camera. Um, Janice, has the porn industry moved into Vegas for the most part now? Also, he threatened to... 
don't talk about X like he was a good person in here. Maniac. Oh, we only hate Hassan. I only stand Janice and Malika. <laughs> Is VR the future? I hate VR porn because the guy isn't allowed to touch you and you have to just like ride a dick into nothingness. It's like not fun. It's like riding a fake dick would be more fun. How many cuts are there in porn? Sometimes there's a lot. Sometimes we just fuck all the way through. See, even you're cold. You put on a hoodie instead of just turning the AC off. No, because I will, because if I turn the AC off normally, um, because there's so much fucking tech in here, it gets really warm in the room usually. I don't know if it still would because now it's like kind of wintry out here, but. Are we not doing communism tonight? We're always doing communism, pal. Um, do you want to, Janice, who do you want to see run for president in 2020? See, I'm a, a, a single issue voter in that I want to be seen as a person. And most politicians won't even acknowledge sex workers as people. Um, Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez has, in fact, replied to someone via Instagram DM saying that she supports sex workers' rights. A but queen. No, I, I don't support Bernie. I'm not a, a Bernie bro. I used to be super pro-Bernie, but he's just... He's an old white dude. It doesn't matter how progressive you are, you're going to you're going to miss stuff. Well, you're saying that because of Sesta, right? Yeah, and also he voted for a bill that puts me and my my colleagues, my coworkers, people I love and care for in danger. And also he he does socialism wrong. <laughs> Sorry. Um, there's a piece by Lorelai Lee and another by Chelsea G. Summers on, you know, some early Bernie days stuff. Like, Lorelai Lee's mother went to a Bernie Sanders rally or some, like, yum Democratic Socialists of America event. Something along those lines. Forget, forgive me if I'm wrong. Um, and she brought her daughter, a baby. And Bernie was like, hey, can you make that baby stop crying? And it was an event where there was supposed to be childcare, and then the childcare was dropped, but she brought her child anyway because she didn't want to miss this event. And I think it's really unfair to remove people who have children from the conversation. I think childcare is really important. How do you expect people to be involved if they literally can't be? Sorry, I'm, now I'm gonna scroll. If Bernie Sanders is the person running for president against Donald Trump, I will vote for him, just like I voted for Hillary Clinton, begrudgingly. But I would prefer to not vote for him. Trump would have eaten that baby. <laughs> he literally would have. Yeah. Would you fuck a fan, said Super XD. Um, why would I want to do that? Oh. Hi, my honey bear. What's wrong? What's wrong? Would you ever consider having kids, Janice? Yeah, I want kids. I'm I'm a super mom type. I know what this I can confirm, and then also beyond that, I I, I feel like uh, like her biggest fantasy is like living in a fucking New Hampshire home and like I just making be a little housewife. yeah no literally like that's like uh, that's her fucking that's the real fantasy. It's not the vanilla sex that she likes to have in her personal life. But beyond that, it, the real fantasy is like just cooking. Yeah, all just day. cooking all day and like I don't know, browsing Pinterest, um, browsing Pinterest and and fucking uh, taking extended shopping trips to Bed Bath and Beyond and focusing really on the Beyond part. You love like getting expensive kitchenware. I love cast iron. And yes, Janice uh, would be an awesome housewife. She, uh, be, I mean, not very clean, but. If I had only that as a job. I'm just saying, like, you're not. If I didn't have a job and my job was only to clean, oh, my God, I'd be amazing at it. I'm just saying. <laughs> what does cum taste like? Please answer. <laughs> um, it depends on what you eat. All cum tastes different. Um, anyway. That's on Beto 2020. I think that there are so Beto? many. Beto? Who the fuck? Beto. 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 Eh. All right, whatever. Beto. More like Beta O'Rourke, am I right? <laughs> Eat your own and find out. 
Janice, please tell us what your favorite podcasts are. I don't listen to podcasts because I don't drive. So She only listens to my show, okay? I really and that's why you guys should fucking stay tuned, all right? Every fucking night at 5 p.m. Pacific. This is where it is. This is this is where it happens. This is her. This is her favorite. Uh, Come show. lives matter. Yeah. Most people in LA listen to podcasts when they're in their car commuting to somewhere, sitting in traffic, like straight up. <gasps> oh, someone said Janice is a son taught you how to roll dolmas. No, but you know what? One time, one oh, time. Oh, I made him. Um, she made me monta. I did. And a threesome after as well. Mm -hmm. It was fucking, it was excellent. It was great. I made meat for him, and I don't eat red meat. Yeah, it was great. It was great. They're like these tiny little dumpling things. There's a shooting at a hospital? Yeah, um, I think something, uh, while we were at the dog park, uh, I believe a shooting occurred in Chicago at a hospital. Huh. I haven't looked into it, but I just wanted to make sure that we have this. Uh, I think that B Bernie has done a lot of good things. I'm just not hailing him as a perfect progressive candidate for everything, you know? Like, I think that there are a zillion brown women who could be better qualified to run than Bernie Sanders. Also, he's fucking ancient. We need to stop electing people who are going to die. He's certainly old, but I, uh, I like him as far as like the the. He most voted to kill me. Uh, the most progressive candidate. Uh, no, I know, I understand. I think that was terrible. I told you, um, Hassan. How do you know? Do you know why you're echoing? I don't know why I'm echoing now. Um, I think it's, it's probably because I. Kamala Harris is a cop. Yeah, Kamala Harris is way worse than uh, Bernie. There are only two people who didn't vote for Sesta, and it's Rand Paul and one other. I forget who. So pretty. You have such a pretty little hand. Oh my god, Fish heard me petting another dog, and he come fucking here, fish. Come jet here. out of come the... Come here, my boy. Come here. Come Isn't here. Tulsi a conservative Democrat? She may be a floor crosser. Am I still echoing? Look at Opal. Opal got jealous when I started petting fish. Oh my god. Can you guys see her? Oh my baby. Oh my baby. Go play. Go play, you guys. Rand would have voted for it if his vote mattered. Rand is a hack. You know, she knows Rand is a hack. Yeah, no, I, I'm not. He didn't vote for it because he cares about sex workers. He voted for it because um, of the fact that it fucks up an internet corner so long. Can I go? I'm going to go get his tug of war toy. They're not going to play with one another, but go Did, ahead. Are you sure? Opal loves it. Uh, people are asking what your ethnicity is. All right, well, you go do that. I'll be here. Anyway. Um... Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. You're... That's a lot of action over here. I don't know. Tulsi smells like a floor crosser. I don't know what Tulsi smells like. I don't know. Thank you, Pizza Roll Samurai, for saying I am one handsome lad. Okay, I'm going to turn it back on to you. Hold on. Pay for the porn star stage for Janice Berger. I am the porn star. Um, Hassan, where'd you get those glasses, my guy? Um, they're Warby Parker. Hassan, when are you going to make good for the three hours of fish time you still owe us? That's not a thing, Katie. Come on. Hold on. Here. Here. Um. Fish is looking at me like I killed his family. He always does that. Um, anyway, keep the microphone closer to your it face. It is literally, if it's any closer, I'd be sucking oh, yeah. it off. Oh, okay, that, that's true. I, I didn't realize that it was so close. Um, coming off of Lurk Mode, have you seen I Love You? It's an I erotic film curated by Brooke Candy and Pornhub. It's so pretty. I did not see that. Damn, you knew exactly what that question was before, mm -hmm. it even, before I even ended it. Oh, because you're reading it as well. Oh, yeah. Oh, you guys want to know another fucking freakish thing about oh. Janice? Oh, that I lurked your stream? 
What? No. Oh yeah, the other the 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 old heads will remember. I'm like, a spy. Um, like the person who was like spying on my stream. It was her. It was me. But it but but also that's not what I was gonna say. The real freakish thing is she reads like a fucking freak, dude. Oh yeah, I read really fast. She reads like a fucking freak. It's like kind of annoying. Where like. I, I will have turned the page over to something and she will be done reading it already. She's like, come on, let me just like, let me finish this article. It's like fucking ridiculous. I don't know how many seconds per page. What's it's the average salary of people working in porn? We don't have salaries. We're all independent contractors. We're freelancers, just like the rest of you. Hassan, have you ever cranked it to a Janice video since you broke up? I'm not going to answer that question. Jerk off to me. That's not, I'm not answering that question. Do you know April O'Neil? She's awesome. Yeah, she's one of my really close friends. She is amazing. Oh my God, Opal, are you kidding? Did she rip it? Yeah. Oh my God, she fucked it up. That's the one you got fished too. Yeah. I can't believe she, like, it took her like three seconds to well, that's what I'm shred saying. The that. thing is, she has the same one at home and she's never done that. Wow, dude. Readers make us all look bad. Yeah, I know. Reading is fucking lame, dude. Are you a virgin? Yes. Yeah, she's a virgin. Fish, go. She's I ruining her toy. Go. Fish, go to bed. Or at least play with her. Go. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> no. Get out of there. I think she feels bad that she did it. Yeah, I know. But then she's like trying to smell the trash. Oh, yeah, yeah, I hope. What are you doing? What are you doing, baby girl? God damn. I gave Hassan a book once, but I don't think he read it. I did. Oh, well, not the book, but I read, like, the the, tr uh, the trans one that you... Oh, yeah, the comic book I got? Yeah, yeah. it was a comic book, though. Um, yeah, yeah Montu is a Turkish dumpling. I forget what the book was. That you I got you The Library by Haruki Murakami. I don't even... Yeah. Well, actually, I gave you my copy. Yeah. No, oh, no, it's here somewhere. I mean, I, I looked at it's it. It's right there. Yeah, it's right up there. It's on the top. How do I fuck my stepsister? You oh, don't. Jesus Go Christ. to therapy. Yes, Have you done we a scene with Ron room. Jeremy? No, Ron Jeremy is a fucking creep. He gropes girls. He sticks his hands into their vaginas without permission. It's disgusting. Also, he's a thousand years old and he looks like a troll. Damn, wrecked. Um, last I checked, Ron Jeremy was banned from the industry. Yeah, because he does shit like that. Yeah, I don't know. He seems really sus. Uh, he seems really suspect when I when I've seen him out and about. A lot of tankies talk about how porn would not exist post-capitalism. Feel like that's not right. You're correct. A lot of people talk about socialism and they're like, sex work would disappear. And let's just be realistic. It wouldn't. People are still going to want to consume sex. And there are going to be people who still aren't having sex. It's just... <sighs> no, but this is important. Please. I'm trying to figure deliver. out how I want to... You know, it's hard to explain. Because... You know, not all industries will be wiped out under, you know, the removal of capitalism. You know, like, people are still going to need to eat. And just because porn isn't a necessity doesn't mean that people are going to stop consuming it. Does it mean that people are going to stop consuming art? That people are going to stop painting? People are going to stop writing, making music, making movies? Porn is just as much a desire for, you know, like, it feeds that desire just as much or even more than those things. Do porn stars exercise? Some people do. Some people don't. I work out now. Thank you very much. Hassan no. is lying. I was really depressed when we met, but now I've been going to therapy yeah, for like see, six that, months. Yeah, we broke up and then she's no longer depressed. <laughs> she was really depressed when we met and then we broke up and she's no longer depressed. How did you pick your porn name? I'm still depressed. I'm just not suicidal. Thanks. Okay. Um, my poor name is my best friend's first name and the last name of a waitress that we had dinner with. No, I haven't been to Turkey, but my mom has, and she loves Istanbul. Yeah. Uh, Y'all dated and she had to go to therapy? Interesting. No, she was going to therapy while we were dating. Yeah, I, I wanted to go to therapy, you know, before, but I couldn't uh, make the commitment, pull the trigger, start, you know, just doing it. It's really hard to find a therapist that you feel works with you. And it's a scary thing to start doing, but I started doing it and I'm really happy that I did and I feel a lot better. I feel more like a person and I'm, I feel like a totally different person. Like I look at, 
some of the feelings that I had six months ago and they don't feel like me anymore. I can't relate to that person that I was. I don't even understand the thought patterns that, you know, made me who I was then. So it's really interesting to grow in that way. And I love therapy. I went today. I'm going to keep going. Um, in this house, we love therapy. Yeah, uh, I, I recommend it to people for sure. Shut up, Hassan. No, don't even start, dude. Shut Do not even. Up. Oh Hassan God. is anti-therapy. I'm not anti-therapy. Oh, my God. You He's know just I'm... an old head. No, He's... you know what I'm pro-therapy. That's not true. Traditional? You're too traditional? Is that what That's it is? That's not what I said at all. And you know I'm pro-therapy. I just said that, like, I'm, I'm too I'm, hard-headed to I'm go making, to therapy I'm myself. I'm fun of you. Okay, I know, but people take this shit seriously. I don't, wanna, I don't want, like, people to think that I'm fucking out there can a stay at home computer nerd score an epic one nighter with a porn star i don't want to fuck any of you you fucking weirdos i'm stop saying shit like that to strangers online isn't gonna make anyone want to have sex with you don't ask don't ask porn stars to to have sex with you it's not gonna work um anyway yeah the problem is when you get into self-loathing cycles and part of refusing help including therapy therapy because i don't deserve help thoughts on antidepressants i've been on six different ones the past year no effects whatsoever i i'm not a doctor but it takes a long time for antidepressants to work like at least four to six weeks to notice a difference for most um ssris so if you've been on six ones in the past year it seems like you're not giving them enough time to work so i would talk to your doctor about that again i'm not a doctor but that's my experience with ssris so check it out Um, Would you ever consider psychedelic therapy? I do psychedelic therapy. I do ketamine-assisted therapy. Do you recommend it? Yes. I highly recommend ketamine therapy. For me, it was amazing. It changed my life. Um, I'm not suicidal anymore, and I used to really be. I used to be, like, thinking about killing myself all the time. Like, every second of the day, just, like, intrusively in the back of my head. And now I don't which is interesting because now I have to focus on all the other problems in my life and I can't just like default to like well at least I'll just kill myself so it's interesting but it's really cool I'm really happy I enjoy life now so weird interesting new area to um, explore but I like it Yeah, a lot of people have never heard about um, um, ketamine therapy. Who the fuck wants to fuck a porn star? Fucking vomit. Who said that? Rashi ra Rashi Rash. I didn't even see it. I'm shocked that I have any, like, fucking anti-sex work um, people in the chat. I mean, I usually... I assume they're being like fucking memeing or whatever, but do you listen to Chapo Trap House or Come Town? Are you asking me or are you asking Janice? Because I listen to both. I love she, Cherokee, da she, ass. She does not listen to either. Um, it's Twitch, people say stuff for kicks. Yeah. You have a lot of anti-work people though. <laughs> Having you in this chat room is very interesting. We should have you more often. Seems like when you're here, he behaves better. That's not. I don't know who said that, but. Someone with fish next to their face. Oh, that means they're a subscriber. God damn it. SSRIs are known to give you limp dick. How do I fix this? You're uniquely qualified for this question. Um, some do, some don't. Uh, you can use horny goat weed. Ask your doctor about uh, any drug interactions, though. But there are some like herbal things you can do to increase your sex drive and increasing your blood flow will help with erectile issues as well also lots of foreplay oh he said he's memeing here on a strip club for 11 years what Hold on. they, they uh, memeing like they just uh, people will sometimes say like uh fucked up shit as like a in a sarcastic way in on twitch hassan is such a submissive turkish boy to you no i'm not dude you're fucking you're out of your mind friend um 
first time I heard about heard about oh my god it's opals in the background I can see her head in front of the in front of the fucking AC how unit beautiful she she's is. so pretty she's just trying to get on the bed though I know. You better not even think about it opal can I just baby wipe her feet and let her on the no, bed no because you have to baby wipe her entire fucking body because she was rolling in the dirt Okay. Like Maybe if you had a duvet ago. cover like a normal person. No, I don't have a duvet cover because I'm not fancy. I don't even know what the fuck that then is. Then you're going to have to throw away your duvet in like a month. A month? No, because I'm not like you. I don't I don't like throw this stuff out. I will use this for years until fish peas on it. Put it in a cover. Janice, best lube brands. Lube brands. Uh, I like Foria if you like coconut oil base. I use this aloe one. Um, a lot. Um, sorry, I was getting a phone call. Mm. Fuck, my phone froze. Sorry. Damn, a song's getting owned in this debate. Janice, you ever have? Have you ever had sex? <laughs> uh, no, I've literally never had sex in my life. Yeah. I wonder how many times porn stars do the deed over the course of their lives. I don't think porn stars fuck any more than, like, a really horny person does. No, just I mean, for, I, like, work. But, like... I mean, you're you're a, a specific... You're, you're different, but... <laughs> um, opinions on that chunky aloe juice drink thing? My friend group is split 50-50. Um, I love aloe water. I'm a big fan. She loves, she loves aloe vera as well. Yeah, as I mentioned, a, I mentioned as it. A, as a sex lube. I mentioned it already. Oh, you, oh, I didn't hear it. And then also the, the fucking weed thing. What was it? What was oh, it for you. I mentioned for that too. Oh, okay, yeah. Are you not listening? Um, No, I was reading the chat. Does chatterbait count as porn? Yes. No, porn fluffers are not real. Oh, yeah. Porn fluffers are not real. <laughs> How long does an average porn shoot last? Uh, anywhere from like 3 to 16 hours do I do my own makeup when I shoot like 1 out of every 5 times how often do you see your coworkers on your off time uh, it depends what's my advice to actual incels the ones without the woman hate um, just be nice be honest ask questions without interrogating um i hung out with this guy once and he was it wasn't like a date or anything and we were friends online but we were hanging out and instead of just having a conversation with me he kept asking me questions and i felt like i was being interviewed like i would try to answer his question and he would ask me another question and i'd be like okay well i was going to answer that but you you keep interrupting me and i don't feel like we're having a conversation i feel like a lot of men take advice like ask questions or show interest and they don't do it right <laughs> i'm just what I i'm getting flashbacks janice does not like to be interrupted I at all but also loves to interrupt herself just putting that out there so have you ever yeah. been obsessed with a fictional character my first crush ever was like, on brock from pokemon i like that you just like skip by that okay. i hate being interrupted it's a trigger for me yeah and, but but she will interrupt you and it's fine it's not fine Center i'm working yourself, on it please um anyway adjustment day by chuck palinock the author of political satire that you really love well thank you for that suggestion um oh someone said she kind of looks like aoc um yeah she's say it <laughs> she's janice sent me a tweet the other day i didn't that, even favorite the tweet by the she way didn't even favorite the, tweet the tweet has no interaction the except tweet has for no me interaction it. but she dm'd it to me and probably a bunch of other dudes it's fine i only sent it to you it's fine it's whatever and um and, and the tweet was what was it alexandria but it was with, like it was multiple like x6s alex x x x alexandria like yeah. at Regianus as aoc in and then like a porno titled alexandria you should do it you should do an I, aoc do you porno. think it's it, do you think it's disrespectful though what? that's you're, you're paying oh, homage hello hello you're paying homage hello, to sweet girl you're, you're paying hello, homage to babe. this person right yeah, I mean, I love her. Also, she would represent my home district if I 
you know. Oh hadn't, yeah, that's true. Hadn't moved. Mm, oh my hammy girl. Mm, oh my hammy girl. Mm, oh my ham lady. Oh my ham lady. Oh, what's wrong? What's wrong? Ah. Okay, okay, come on. Jeez. She never does this. She just wants your attention. She's like, you, you've been. Because you've never been away from her in the same room for three hours. Because I know this from personal uh, experience. Like, you literally baby her too much. You baby her more than I baby fish. And I baby. Well, I baby fish as well. I feel like talking about her sexually as a public figure undermines her political work. That's what I mean. Like, I, I make porn parodies and I don't think that it's insulting. But I feel like she's already working so hard to be taken seriously i don't want other people to interpret it as disrespectful. oh yeah 100 percent. and they would use it they would weaponize that against exactly. her so quickly they'd be like oh look there's a porn parody today. yeah it's like look, you're such a joke use her clothes for like uh yeah i and yeah. the fact that she does instagram lives and like makes dinner at home i know which is awesome by the yeah, way she um, represents the real america I mean, look, she's she's fucking great. She's really awesome. Like the the fact that she's having like cyber town hall. I like pineapple while she's on pizza. cooking, um, is is an incredible thing. It's not something that they should be making fun of. It's like, oh, look at this fucking loser politician who's like really fucking relatable because she can't pay uh for for a zillion dollars yeah insanely expensive rent in dc and then beyond that look at this fucking loser who's like staying in on a friday night and like actually talking to her constituents rather than like jerking off some fucking defense contractor uh at, at some like posh fucking dc eatery like this is it, it's madness to me that like this is this is the disdain that uh these elite douchebags in fucking media have uh, for politicians it's so it, i mean uh, not for politicians sorry the constituents like they don't give a fuck about you and one of the things that i personally love about alexandria ocasio cortez is the fact that her mere existence has broken the brains of so many fucking conservatives where they literally they just cannot fathom that this person who is a completely normal person who's a fucking blue collar worker worked at a fucking bar smart <coughs> can i interrupt you for a second <coughs> wait let me finish this rant who's smart blue collar works at a fucking bar who just could be a normal human being who also is like hey by the way like capitalism is not really working out for anybody let's fucking fix this system and you know that's why I, that's why these people are like they, they have no way to, to address this so they're like calling her fucking stupid or uh making fun of the way she uh you know making fun of the clothes that she wears that like she's not running around in a fucking barrel naked be, like she's some cartoon character who's uh you know she has to be insanely poor because she's a socialist like so fucking stupid anyway um so i was gonna refer to someone said you say the real america but you're only talking about the coast people aren't instagramming in wyoming are you fucking kidding? You think what? that people don't have Instagram in Wyoming? <laughs> Bro, what you do you You think mean? that brown people don't l live places? Yeah, also What I mean by the real America is people who aren't gazillionaires. People who no, struggle really to pay rent and keep track of their finances. And people who work minimum wage jobs, service industry jobs, that kind of shit. No, that's really fucking stupid. Like, of course, of course, people in the middle of America use Instagram. Like, what a fucking stupid statement that is. Holy shit, dude. Like, the only people that don't use Instagram are the people that are voting fucking conservative because they're about to die in, like, a couple years, okay? Like, beyond that, everyone under the age of... Like, people are all over social media, dude. Are you kidding me? Even fucking Republicans are all over social media. I mean, look at this, uh... Um, look at this... California sucks. We are centrist establishment dem trash. Yeah, exactly. I mean, California is fucking terrible. They voted for Diane Feinstein. It's because we're too against, big. They voted against fucking. They voted against a, a, a the public housing. bank. They voted against a proposition rent ten, control. which is rent control. Like California is really weird, dude. There Cal were a lot of advertisements on Hulu, like from what I was yeah. watching, that was like, "Vote no on ten. Vote no on 10. Yeah, because Blackstone, um, a private equity firm, spent seventy-seven point five million dollars. On a on a fucking vote no on ten ad initiative, and because and they did that because they own fourteen thousand units in the state of California, and they don't want fucking rent control to, to ever the pass. Rich? And the reason why they don't want rent control to ever pass is because they uh, are the 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 idea that um, you know people are are no longer going to be placed out of their housing uh, due to like they're going to be outpriced 
uh, is terrifying to them. So much so that a seventy-seven point five million dollar fucking upshot, where they where they may or may not have even won that initiative, was nothing for them. Was nothing for them to actually uh, like fucking throw that money in a, and burn it in a pile of cash because the the outcomes of like people being able to pay or afford their their housing is much more devastating for uh, for a company like Blackstone. F- terrible, dude. California is 100% anti-poor people. Yeah. Look at Opal trying to get comfortable. I know. I she see. got in the closet. I know. She she was she was sitting in the closet before too. Uh, we we don't use that word sublux. What I don't know what they're the saying. The R word. Um, all of America's anti-poor people, to be honest. Yeah, you're right. Thank you, AJS, by the way, for gifting another gift sub to Yandami eight eight nine three. Um, that's fifteen gift subs in the channel. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, there's no class consciousness in America, and that's why so many fucking poor idiots in living in, especially living in like Republican districts or Republican states, think like they, they're going to be fucking millionaires one day. Or even if they're not going to be millionaires one day, if they can continue to oppress marginalized communities, like at least they'll be better off than a, a black person, or at least they'll be better off marginally than a fucking brown person. So then it's fine. You can live comfortably in your in your uh, you know in your poverty. Uh, where your entire family is addicted to fucking fentanyl and you have no like actually well-paying jobs available and your your social programs are uh, destroyed and and you vote for politicians who will eviscerate uh, all of the good things that the government does for you uh, because you know you don't know any better um no i'm not a tanky uh, and we, yeah. in terms of california pe- kicking people off a s- like disability assistant for being unable to work. I don't know any specifics about that, but the disability benefits and the whole thing in America is broken. There are people who have disabilities who can't make more than a certain amount of money or they'll have their benefits taken away from them, which is absurd because it keeps them in the cycle of poverty. So the whole system is broken and we should just tear it down. Is it bad that I almost want Republicans to cut all the social safety nets just so the boomers can see how fucked they're going to be? No, it's not great. That's not. Yeah, that is bad. Um, I, you sound I vo- like someone who voted for Donald Trump to, like, bring forth anarchy. Yeah, I mean, I'm not an accelerationist. I, I don't I vote for a harm reduction and I urge others to do that as well, or at least out of spite. Either yeah. one works. Um, Same. And I mean, like. People are very callous in the way they describe uh, the future of social security, the fact that it's going to be insolvent in like uh, in the next two decades. But the reality is that's your money. You know what I mean? You're still paying into social security currently and you're not going to be able to get that money out when you when you when the year 2030 arrives or 2034 or whenever the fuck it's going to be insolvent. So let's not destroy social programs to prove a point. Yeah. Anyway, I know that was what someone said. Um, you yeah, know, I, I, I saw that. I only vote for the candidate that will hurt Republican voters the most. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> oh, my God, we've been streaming forever. I know. This is li- this is what I do, man. This is what I do every fucking day. It's we like, broke up before you started doing this. I know. That's true. But, um, you know, I, yeah, it's been three hours. We've been talking for three straight hours. I think this is a good place to end it, though, um, for the time being. I might come back on later after this, but I have to go cook some food right now. Um, but, yeah, because I'm going to put this on YouTube as well for those of you who want to watch it in VOD later. Um, but, yeah, thank you, Janice Griffith, for coming onto the stream and coming into the studio. This is a studio, by the way, for those this of you who This is literally are... his bed right here. Yeah, true. It is my bed. We used to have sex right there, and he would turn his camera away just in case. Okay. Yes, that is also true. We we had sex. We had sex one time, only yeah. once, because we're good Muslims. Inshallah. <laughs> um, but anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, we might have Janice back on if she knows how to fucking use Discord and stuff, uh, potentially in the future. Um, but beyond that, Janice, what do you want to plug? Buy my flashlight, subscribe to my private Snapchat, or donate money to a local food bank for the holidays. Yeah those things all right well thank you so much janice for coming on and um everybody 
I am done for the time being. I might come back later. I'm just going to go cook right now because I'm fucking starving. And I apologize. I hope you guys enjoyed this, though. Um, and uh, I'm going to have more guests on on the stream because I think this is, like, fun and interesting. Stop asking her to fucking go on Chapo, you dipshit. <laughs> I, like, Jesus Christ. Um, anyway. I will. I will raid someone. I'm looking. I'm probably going to raid Destiny, though. Let's be real. If he's on. Yeah, I'm going to go raid Destiny. Um, anyway. All right. Love you all. And uh, thank you for, again, thank you once again, Janice, for coming on. Hi. And...